do 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 What's up, Dane? How goes it? Eh, you know, streams are great. Everything else isn't. How about you? I know people constantly tell me not to say that shit. And you know what? I don't fucking care. I'm not going to pretend and lie to everybody. I just it don't have it in me to lie to people about that shit. <clears throat> you want someone to lie to you about that stuff? That's a you problem. Okay. This had a save file, right? Yeah, there we go. Mock. Let's go. Oh, right. We were at the pirate section. Cool. Work, sleep, unwind with games and streams. I haven't been able to unwind with games in weeks. Off stream, of course. Streams are the pretty much the only games I've been able to play for weeks because on my days off, executive dysfunction has literally been all. Cannot make any decisions, even ones for fun or relaxation. Yeah, I'm playing on hardware. That's right. Uh, an AV modded Famicom. It's been modded for RGB output. Where am I? I'm trying to remember where we were. Was I supposed to go here? I think I was supposed to go here. Maybe. I don't know if we beat this. <clears throat> Hold on, let's turn this up a little. There you go. Did we beat this? There's a glitch where the save doesn't happen with some emulators. Oh yeah, I don't use emulators. <clears throat> I don't like using emulators. I've used them once, I think, in the last two years on stream because I could not get the game working on the retro PC and it was Monkey Island. So I used, uh, what's it called? Scum VM. I think some of you have heard of that, right? <clears throat> And once I got into the game, it was pretty, pretty seamless. Didn't we beat this? Didn't we beat this cave? How would I even figure that out? I don't know if we did, to be honest. Oh. That's a good question. Okay, I don't know how to get that. <clears throat> it's a pretty good question, yeah. I... I'm pretty frustrated with my memory. You must know, use emulation because randomizers. I mean, you can play randomizers on hardware too. That's what I do. <clears throat> But, and there's a big butt to that, right? A big booty, a big honking booty. You need a flash cart. And those are not cheap and certainly not accessible to everyone if they can't afford them, right? So, it's the most reasonable way to play a randomizer is on emulation. You're 100% asleep for this? I might as well have been, man. Which is unfortunate because I like this game. Big honking booty. Is that Wario? Nice. Star Tropics is on the Switch Online thingy. Nice. There was a specific way to get those. I don't recall what they were. Let's see. That ain't it. Ba -da. Do you consider that an option? You know, I'm not like a big randomizer aficionado, right? I'm no authority, no authority on them. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> but I can say that every single one I've done is I've always played on hardware. Like that's never changed.
Wow. They don't give you time for that, do they? <laughs> they do not give you time for that. <clears throat> not exactly financially stable. Uh, I mean, that's the life of a Twitch streamer right there. Bo -ba -do -ba -ba. You can get one, but two is super tight and possible. So the thing is, I don't know if we ever beat this cave. I want to say no. Correct me if I'm wrong. <clears throat> but doesn't this cave leave to that lead leave lead to that boat right there or somewhere near it? Is that right? Well, I'm gonna try this spray. These things are really foggy today, and I don't know why. <sighs> I didn't beat this cave? Okay. <clears throat> Yo, thank you for the follow, whomever you are out there. Enjoy your anonymous lurk, or join us in the chat if you'd like. I always like doing anonymous follows. A lot of you have heard my reasons why, but not everybody, so I'll go ahead and do that again. I'm a big lurker when I'm busy, right? Or if I don't have the, you know, mental spoons to get into a social encounter. Because a lot of streamers are very genial when you follow their channel. They want to thank you, right? They want to be like, hey, thanks for following. You know, maybe they'll ask questions or whatever. But I don't always have the energy or the time to respond to that. You know, maybe I'm busy. Maybe I'm exhausted. Maybe I just, you know, I don't have the spoons. So what I was doing was waiting until their stream was over to follow. But the problem was half the time I was forgetting to follow. <clears throat> so I decided the best way to facilitate that was to make sure that people's names don't pop up when they follow so they don't feel that pressure. And if they want to be acknowledged for it, they can just say something. <clears throat> so that discretion is entirely theirs. Hit, Hito, 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 Retro Gaming. Hito, yo, thank you. You're totally anonymous. <laughs> Hi. Hi. You do the same thing? Yeah. Dude, I, I like giving the discretion to the viewer because I want that discretion when I'm a viewer. Oh my god, I gotta get out of this. This is great. Hi. Hi. <laughs> 99 percent of the time you don't mind that? Yeah, no. I it's like I don't think every channel should do it that way. I think every channel should decide which way is best for them and their community, right? <clears throat> But I still wait most of the time to follow unless I am ready to, you know, talk and hang out and be a part of that vibe, right? <clears throat> do, 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 do. I saw a uh, channel yesterday that I had never watched before. Also, Hito, I imagine with your name you stream, right? <clears throat> Do you stream retro games? That's obviously. Obviously. <laughs> That'd be funny if that was your name and you played like nothing but like fucking Valorant or something. Or Apex. <laughs> <clears throat> you know, just a little irony in the name. What's up, Shane? Best streaming advice in general. Do the things you like to see as a viewer. Yeah, absolutely. Hi, Tide. It's good to see you back. You thought you were the only one? No, it's pretty common. I'd say it's... I wouldn't say it's half and half, but a lot of people I've talked to do the same. You love them a lot, but you're mostly variety. Right on. I'm still trying to dabble a little more in variety. <clears throat> Indie, like, retro adjacent indies, primarily. I did some of that placid plastic dunk simulator a couple times. Which was quite silly. I wonder if there's just, like, a... Let's just get one of the hearts. Uh-oh, it doesn't look like I'll get one. Hold on. It's gonna be tight. Nice. Whew. That was tight. Oh, boy. <clears throat> oh, 
punch to reply and be like, yeah, man, I can play retro like Final Fantasy 12. It is retro. <clears throat> Doo -doo -doo. It's PS2. Plays only PUBG a game is dead. That means it's retro. I just saw somebody streaming yesterday. <laughs> it's not true. It's oh, sorry. I get stuttery when I'm anxious. <clears throat> um, it's certainly not as popular as it used to be, though, right? Did that game go like free to play too? Whoa! whoa okay, I forgot about that. <clears throat> yeah, anonymous follows is a security measure against troll follows. Yeah, like if you get like follow botted by a bunch of dipshits. I can't even see the name, let alone anyone else viewing. We'll never see the name. So when people like try to follow with accounts with like offensive names, I literally never see them. <clears throat> <laughs> so they literally can't do anything. <clears throat> they learned that pretty quickly early on that it doesn't work. Shane, how's your streams been going, man? Lily, how you doing? So many other BGs. BRs? You mean battle royales? Oh, God. Oh, okay. <clears throat> PUBG's popular on mobile. Wow. That is not something I would have ever expected. That's cool, though. I think it's something that we as like kind of mainstream gamers forget frequently is that <clears throat> the gaming population like demographically mobile is way 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 bigger than I think any of us really give credit for. <clears throat> Especially outside of like North America, Australia, Europe, like Asian markets, stuff like that, you know, South America, etc. like mobile gaming. It's massive, massive audience. Japan, yeah, Japan too, yeah. <clears throat> do, 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 do. No, Randy, I, if you did that, I did not see that ever. Do, 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 do. I do not play mobile games myself. <clears throat> Excuse me. Do, 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 do. What's the last mobile game I played? It was like seven years ago. For a day or two, I played a mobile... Not a day or two. It was a couple days. I played a mobile game, but it was on an Android emulator. It wasn't even on a mobile device. Oh man, didn't need that damage. What is that sign? Oh, I think that's an extra life. <clears throat> yep, that's an extra life, very cool. Dude, dude, what was it called? It was like one of those Final Fantasy style gotcha games that I couldn't add money to even if I had wanted. <laughs> but as soon as I realized that the game basically just gatekeeps you without spending money after playing it so much, I just stopped. It was... It just felt like someone was dangling a carrot in front of me, and every time I got close, they would yank it away. And I just felt really stupid trying that game. Um, and I know there are fans of gacha games here, and I'm not saying that you are that. I'm saying that I was because of how susceptible I am to those kind of mechanics. <clears throat> so I have to avoid games like that because I can get sucked in pretty bad. So yeah. Da -da -na -na. You still play Pokemon Go with your nephews? I think that was the last mobile game that I played a decent amount. I played that for a few weeks. I like that. I don't think I... I think I did put like 10 bucks into it and if I recall it was like for storage space or something I don't remember what what it unlocked but it was when the game initially came out like on release 
<clears throat> and I was playing it enough. I'm like, okay, I could put 10 bucks into this. There's a Disgaea RPG on mobile. Gotcha Auto Battler. Uh, that's too bad. Doo -doo. Felt like you were cheating to roll around in your wheelchair to get steps in the game. I mean... I don't think so. <laughs> you were moving around. You were just using a different method. No, Opera Omnia, I never played that. All the Bravest, I never played that. It was... I don't know the name. I can't remember. I'm sorry. It wasn't those, though. Record Keeper. Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> that was the one. I like the sprites. It was cool seeing Final Fantasy characters from... Like you know, modern era or whatever, or even PS1, but with, that had sprites, because I like that art style. I thought it was kind of neat. But yeah, the game kept gatekeeping gameplay. Like, I would just, like, do a couple, like, dungeons or whatever, and then it was like, okay, you have to wait three hours to do another, and I couldn't figure out why. Like, I was looking in, like, online and, like, in-game art or, or, like, help and whatever, and that timer is there. I'm like, why is this timer here? I don't get it. What did I do wrong? I thought I was being punished or something. No, that's literally how games like that are designed. You can pay money to remove the timer. That is predatory. <laughs> like, that's super toxic to me. All oh, right, this is just an exit. Okay, okay. We gotta go left. Keep our eyes open for secrets, chat. Ah, oh, god damn! What a nasty dungeon this is. <clears throat> Alright, let's do our best. <clears throat> Hydration? Was there a redeem? No, but I'll do it anyway. Oh, I forgot to fill this up. <clears throat> they closed down the only mobile game you got super into. You love playing it and kind of wish you didn't. You... Okay. <clears throat> I, am I supposed to guess? <laughs> I am in Pokemon storage. I think that's what it was, yeah. But it was when it first came out, right? That was six or seven years ago, right? It was like 2016 or something like that, 2015. It's been out that long. You're weak to caffeine. You get a Mountain Dew 10 hours ago and you're still not tired. Wow. Ooh, I see Mechatom, interesting. Limited playtime curable with money or play all you want, but you get nowhere with gotcha. Right, either one doesn't work for me personally. You know, cool for the people that like that stuff. Again, I'm not judging. I'm just... Spray didn't work. <clears throat> I'm very susceptible to those kind of mechanics, so I gotta stay away. I get a dick. That's why I don't play MMOs, too. <clears throat> Oh, you were talking about Record Keeper. Oh, okay. Dungeon Keeper. Hmm. 2018? I don't think so. Because I specifically remember <clears throat> looking at it. Ah, oh, shit. We're dead. All right. I specifically remember looking at it at one of my previous jobs, and I wasn't at that job in 2018. So... At the latest, it was 2017. But I don't think so, because I stopped doing said job at the beginning of 2017. So I think it was 2016. Do-do-do. 
One perfect summer, everyone was nice to each other. Oh, when Pokemon Go came out? Yeah. It was wild seeing, like, just people out at, like, parks and stuff. <laughs> like, what the hell? Is this the 90s again? <laughs> like, what happened? <sighs> kind of neat. My friend, uh, she's a streamer. She goes by Ash said hi. She posted a picture on her Twitter recently <clears throat> of like just things she's done in her hometown of New York. And one was a picture of Central Park when that game came out. And there was just hundreds and hundreds of people there. It was honestly really cool. <laughs> it's like, wow, they were all there for that. Can you imagine? Like, you don't see that like ever for any games. Hundreds of people were there. Thought it was around 2018. No, we can't be. Do the opposite with those gotcha games. We'll give them a shot by playing as long as possible without spending a penny. That's good. That's good self-control. I'm impressed. <clears throat> June 2016. That sounds right. Sounds about right. So I was about six months away from that quote unquote promotion. Oh, come on. Promotion job change. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm. Will they respawn if you walk to the room again from the left? That's a good question. We should try that next time. I don't know. And I want to test that theory. Do, 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 do. There we go. Ba -da -ba -da. All right. Na 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 na. Boo ba 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 ba. You need next to a park. You were confused. Thought there was an event going on. There kind of was, right? <clears throat> you remember that in Vancouver? Yo, Adam. What's up, man? Dude, I was like so happy to share that fucking picture with you in Discord. I'm like, yo, this is nice. <laughs> I don't know where it's sitting right now. Oh my god, you can actually lose a life from those. <sighs> this game. Okay. The game Adam just released. It's like number seven hidden gems on Steam. <laughs> I was like, yes! Celebrate your friends, W's. Your local city zoo still goes Pokemon, does Pokemon Go events, and a good 40 or 50 people still show up. That's cool. That purple water's a down arrow. Yeah, it just pointed me towards losing a life. <laughs> you, you love being a hidden gem, means people enjoy it, but you don't have to be known. Right on. He's no... What's that guy's name? Peter Molyneux or whatever? Oh god, there's the sound. Yeah. <laughs> I went back in there because I wanted to see if there's a secret wall. Yeah, it's on mobile too. I forgot about that. I keep forgetting that. Was it... Poosh XL is on Steam and mobile. It's definitely the kind of game that would vibe with mobile, too. I must give full disclosure, I've seen tons of people play it for hours and hours, and I have yet to try it. Mainly because I don't play games like that. I don't know why. I just never have. I'm not opposed to it, especially with that price tag. I'm doing real good. It's a tough game. We're gonna get through this. All right, let's test that theory. We'll get through here. And then we'll see if it lets us go back in. I have a feeling that door shuts behind us, but I don't know. The blocks might just still be... Oh, fuck, I did it wrong. We're dead. <laughs> GG. 
Dun, 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 dun. Is that what it is? That's causing the low health beep to reset? Is it any sound effect? That makes sense. Yeah, if I'm spamming attack, it's like beep, 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 beep. Oh, man. It's all one channel. Wow. Alright, let's see what happens. Yeah, locks behind you, I thought so. Go, 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 go! Saw it coming. Da da ba da ba da ba. Whoop. 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 Well, that was much less hassle if I do it that way. All right, we're not going down this time. I I don't feel like playing roulette with my lives, so I didn't realize those signs could actually take a life away. So yeah. We're not gonna do that again. Hmm, I'll have to check that. I got a DM about something. Gah! Oh. Uh, oh, damn it. Wait a minute. Yo, Tiamat, with the five months, and he says, <laughs> Uh, yo, well, of course. This game is ruthless. You have to just guess. A lot of, a lot of leaps of faith in this game. If there's a platform that will appear when you jump on it. I don't miss games to do that personally you bet it's up we'll try up if we when we, not if but when we get there again we'll get there again You gotta make that noise when you jump or it doesn't count. Alright. Like this. Wah! See? Counted. I didn't get hit. That's how it works. Mostly positive. Mostly positive. Team man, how's it going today? What's mostly positive? It was normal for the time when this game was out. The whole invisible platform thing? Yeah, it's ruthless. You gotta lean into the jump? That's true, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, okay. So we have to guess where the thing is. The one-up signs are mostly positive. Oh, so it's like, what, a two out of three chance to get a one-up? So we went left, it didn't work. Nor did up. Nor did up. The nice thing about this, as you can see, there doesn't seem to be a finite amount of continues. So you can just keep trying and it has a save system. So even, you know, maybe you've been playing a couple hours and you're like, I need a break. You don't have to start all over again. Which the idea of doing this game in one shot. Oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, 
Thanks for 50 bits, Gen Gear. Okay. Go, go, go. Can't stop. Why you remember it being easy? Who, Dane? Yeah, it could be. Because of the forgiving save system. Alright, let's try this again. That wall looks sus right there. I don't like that this is pointing down and it just leads to a room of death. Death. I, I actually forgot I wanted to check the walls in here. Let's do it. Let's do it. At least these are easy, you know? No big deal. We have seen, like, false walls like this that aren't conveyed or marked in any way. Shouldn't have gotten that. <laughs> Rude! Oh, come on. Alright, this isn't paying off, is it? Alright, as far as I know, there's nothing in here except... bad stuff. Do, 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 do. Well, up was wrong, left was wrong, so was down, right? I think we tried down. Now what? This is where I feel like I'm stuck. Two ups and downs. You're right. That's true from right here, right? <sighs> okay. Oh, look, I got my little shooty stars. Here we go. I wish there was a way to test that. Instead of just hoping for the best. Dang. Taking damage in this room means that I can't get the two hearts and have the shooting stars. Although I don't know if that was what did it. I may have gotten stars from those snakes. I don't know. Hello, Luna Track. How was your night? Shooting stars. How was your stream? What'd you do? I got one star from the snakes. Oh, that's it. I don't know then. I found a pee pee. <laughs> Good for you. You know? Be proud of that. <laughs> Uh, NES goodness? This game's on your list. What'd you do tonight? Beep me up! Alright, so no directions get me across here. At this point, I don't know what I'm doing. <clears throat> it's worth the play, but I would honestly recommend people use a guide for this. Because I'm literally having to just die every time I attempt to find an invisible platform. Like, actually die in the game, just to see if it's there. <clears throat> what was in the up room? A dead end. Bayou Billy, Bayana Commando, Ninja Gaiden, Super Mario Bros. Ooh, good selection. Bayou Billy's underrated. Yo, what up, Chupon? How you doing today? Yeah, we want to try and beat this tonight. 
we started with uh, Metal Max earlier. It was my last attempt at that game. We had to bid that game a fond farewell. Do 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 do. Imagine... Oh, I forgot to jump there. Imagine playing this game when it came out. This would have blown me away. Oh. I always did want it as a kid, too, and I never got it. So this is still my first ever playthrough. Doo -doo -doo. Your dad made paper maps? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. So yeah, this is... This room. There's nothing in here. Just a dead end. It's like... You see those little, like, shadows? You can get in here from those, but you can't. They're one way, so. Last attempt? Uh, what? <laughs> what the fuck did I just experience? Oh my goodness. Okay. I guess we found a new area <clears throat> on accident. I'll take it. What was I saying before I just got the poo scared out of me by that pitfall? <clears throat> I got Star Tropics. It's a thing this game does, huh, Monty? Welcome back, by the way. Give what back? Whoops, I went the wrong way. Dun dun. It's to keep out vampires? Oh, okay. Maybe I should get one of those. But no, I don't have a room like that in my house. Because I've never owned one. <laughs> and I'm sure that that will be true forever. Go go! Once I get out of this room, I can take a breath. Woo! Remember that time. Nice. Feels good. Okay. What the hell was I talking? Oh man, we're not out yet. Hold on. One more. One more. One more. One more room. Blah. Wanted to see if I got hit it down. Okay, now we're good. Dun, dun, dun. Something about shadows? I was talking about shadows? I don't no idea then. It's great to be back and such. <laughs> I don't recall talking about the shadows, but yeah. Do 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 do. Beep, boop, boop, do, do, do. I mean, that's just an apartment, you know, Chupon. I just won't ever have a house. That's really what it boils down to. Um, what was I saying? Hold on, let me scroll chat really quick. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Last attempt of Metal Max. Right. Because it was me trying to test how well I could stream a game. <clears throat> It basically no one has ever heard of. And instead of giving it one stream, I gave it four. This is so mean. Oh, oh God, wow. Impressive. Come back here. I know, right? Oh, jeez. Can I not jump over those? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No. Okay. So that whole row is... Those three tiles below me, they're all pitfalls. So I don't think we can get to the middle there. I think we have to go on the right side somewhere. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. 
Did I pull on a wall and fall? No, there's a, like invisible pitfalls. All over the place. It's pretty nasty. It's pretty mean. Dang. Yeah, like, that's a big goal of mine, to be able to stream literally any kind of game like that. And hopefully people vibe with it. And I didn't accomplish that. So... You know, like, for me, that's a really painful pill to swallow, given how long I've been streaming. <clears throat> it means I've been doing a lot of things wrong. Do, 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 do. Oh, nice. Okay. Secret obtained. <laughs> hey, that's a PB. All right, I take it. We could do that again. So I'm gonna have to start. I know this sounds fucking found a pee -pee. completely ridiculous. So bear with me here. And for God's sake, stop telling me why you can't be here. <laughs> Nobody's entitled to your time. I don't want to hear it. I'm not owed anything from any of you. <laughs> But as ridiculous as it sounds, I need to start teaching myself how to stream. <laughs> and I'm not kidding. I'm not fucking kidding about that either. The more of a veteran you get in something, the less open you are to new ideas and new things. Because you think you know how everything works. And I do not. So I need to learn how to stream. Ooh, I can see like the interference. Oh, my freaking remote's up there. I was gonna try to adjust the signal while we're blabbing away here. Do it, do it. A far away remote is not a valid reason to not try, right? Right? What is my freaking phase at? Go to 180. That's so much better! Why was it at 90 phase? None of you were... Well, some of you will know what that means. Most of you won't. To be honest, I don't even know technically what it means. <laughs> Alright, we should be good. Technically, I don't understand phase. I just know that it affects how well... Things line up on the pixels, you know. <clears throat> I don't. One is the worst, yeah. <clears throat> you can think of three things that you wouldn't come here for, and one is because it makes you physically ill. Is it a uh, Mohawk and Microphone Jack or Bubsy 3D? <laughs> uh, Street Fighter 6 is characters you never heard of. That's true of every Street Fighter when they were new. They've always introduced new characters. <clears throat> they, I would honestly be supremely disappointed had they not. L-E-O-P-A-R-D. Leopard. Leopard. Okay. Thank you. I knew it was kind of weird in spelling versus how it's pronounced, at least around here. Leopard. Very different from a leper, indeed. <laughs> Mr. Hissy is a black neighborhood cat around your area. Okay, cool. Ah, oh, shit, I went the wrong way. Or did I? Oh, I got a heart out of it. Actually, that was a good play. Because we got this out of it. You did Spidey movie? Plus Tears of the Kingdom. What do you mean, Spidey movie? You sh Are you saying you streamed a movie? Because you probably shouldn't say that or do that. <laughs> Unless you've got permission. 
<clears throat> is Star Tropics hugely popular? No. As far as retro games, though, it's light years ahead of what I was just playing. Hmm. Hi, Fairly Gay. You're seeing where you can foster personal growth for the channel, which you see as a positive. You realize you don't like happening. What I don't like happening or trying to find ways to resolve it. Yes. Yes. There are channels that I watch where they can play any game, specifically retro channels. Any game. People will show up for it. And so I try to understand what it is about those channels. And this isn't like, oh, they have higher viewers than me and I'm comparing myself to them. No, because that's the fucking road to, you know, just losing your goddamn mind and hating what you do. What I want to know is what it is that sets them apart that allows them to do that, right? <clears throat> Where they can play anything. Now, if they, like, started playing, like, an FPS, obviously they're going to see similar drops. That goes without saying. Oh, shit. Oh, what a nasty room. Nasty room. Ooh, that guy almost got me! Oh, it's select. Uh-oh. I forgot my controller was giving me problems. This is going well. What the hell? Why do I keep getting stunlocked? Controller. Okay, I guess just not listen to it. Uh, Balrog the Boxer is your main and Street Fighter? I haven't played since 4. But my main was always Ken or Hanjuri. I mean, I went with my namesake. But also his playstyle where it fits my, me best. Which is just fast and aggressive non-stop. Yo, Kitty Pit, how you doing? Oh, that sucks, Chupon. Too bad. Kitty Bit, how's your uh, streams been going? It's unusual to see you this late anymore. Growth and change is something you battle debate on for your channel. And it's something that not everyone needs to do or should, right? Like, there's nothing wrong with doing something as a hobby and wanting to foster it and see it grow, right? But there's also nothing wrong with just doing it for the fun of it, right? But I don't just do this for the fun of it. This is like my career and passion. So I do everything I can to make it work, you know, in a, within reason, of course. You know, I don't do things that are against my morals or ethics or things that I would hate doing just for money, right? I don't do that shit. That's why I've said no to so many ideas for like sub goals or incentives. I'm like, it just, it would feel like a sellout, you know, and I didn't. Like, the, I think the word sellout is misused so much. I think the only time it's ever in play is if somebody sold out their ethics, you know, and their integrity. That's the only time you're a sellout, right? In my opinion. So me doing things that I would hate for money would be a sellout, like me being a sellout. So I don't, I don't do that stuff, even if it does hurt, you know, my bank accounts. <clears throat> Hades causes you more problems than Mohawk and Headphone Jack. Wow. That's surprising. Oh, that's too bad, Dane. I wonder if you don't have, like, epilepsy or something. Or just... I mean, some people just get motion sick from certain games. What I would try for that game, Dane, is I think you can turn off Screen Shake. And from a lot of friends, I know that that's helped them. I'm, you probably looked into that if this is an ongoing issue for it. You know, you probably know better than anyone else. But if you haven't tried that, it's worth looking into. Because that one does cause that kind of issue for a lot of people. You don't know if maining Akuma counts because he's just more Ken Ryu. He's, he is and he isn't. They have the same fighting style, but they play all play differently. Are you supposed to fall? Yes. Yes, to get to this room I'm in now, yes, you do have to fall. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hey, Dave, how are you? Favorite games to watch, yeah. The ones you don't care to play yourself. I like that too, honestly. I like doing that too. Like a game I know I'm never going to play. Like those God of War games. 
I'm never gonna play those, but they're fun to watch. Do 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 do. Look at this fucking room. Holy shit. What? Uh, go. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> what do you want me to do in there? Ah, oh, this game. That put me all the way back here too. So yeah, chat. We gotta learn how to stream this here. I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah, I was talking about other streamers. There's there's some big channels that I watch in the retro category who could play any retro game. And not see dips by percentage. If at all. Compared to what I do. So I got a lot to learn. You know, it's an interesting new tool that Twitch and other analytics sites have given me that I've been mostly avoiding, but sometimes curiosity gets the best of me. I can see when I get unfollowed. I don't know who it is. I wouldn't want to, to be honest. That's not my business, but I can see when it happens and there's usually dips when I'm talking about this topic. <laughs> I'm not going to sweat it. <laughs> I'm not going to hide who I am for people. You know, it's up to all of us individually to find the places that we feel like we belong the most. I'm always transparent about stuff here. And I'm not going to change that for anybody. But what I do need people to understand about me is that when I do talk about these things, there because I am perceiving a problem with the way I'm doing things and I'm looking for answers and it is never at any single point me looking for answers outwardly as in it's nobody's fault right it's just not so that's why I was telling Dane earlier stop telling me why you can't be here because I'm not entitled to your time <laughs> I'm not owed anything from any of you. That's why I'm grateful when any of you show up. Like, it just... Because, like, think about it. Like, I, the only comparisons I make are to my own past successes. And when I look at where I was three, four, five, six, seven years ago, imagine if seven years ago me saw this shit now. Blown away. <laughs> just blown away. So it's important not to lose that perspective, but also from your standpoint to understand where I'm coming from and that it's never looking to you to place any responsibility, entitlement, or blame. It is me trying to best figure out where the solutions are to my problems and or questions. <laughs> do, do, do. Right, like kitty split? What does the cute kitty want? Let's see what Dave said. I think I forgot to read the rest of Dave's answer. I got off on a tangent there. Dave likes watching Ooh, Willow play Link to the Past. Oh. Oh, Z Z3SM? Yeah. You like watching me play old retro JRPGs? Heck yeah, dude. Right on. Visual novel dating sim games. Do you like Fall Hollow? That's a good one. You should check that one out. You watch Dax Bonus play all of Hotful Boyfriend. I've seen people play that, and it's got surprisingly good writing. <laughs> <laughs> but it is a pigeon dating sim at the same time. It's 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 an experience. <sighs> you don't like the logo. What well like I I don't understand what that means. <laughs> don't stretch yourself too thin. With regards to streaming, oh, it's easy to do that. I see people who try to do like every genre under the sun every week and nobody knows what they're about. I used to do that. That was a problem. That was a hard lesson to learn. All right, Lickety, pick where you're going or go on the floor. <laughs> Just the most inconvenient possible spot. IRL break. 
What's an IRL break? Dun, 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 dun. Played Street Fighter 6. I like fighting games, but I don't like streaming them. Same reason I don't like playing shmups. I can't look at chat when I play them. You know, it takes away my main prime directive. What we're doing right now. Like, look at how many of you are engaged right now. And I obviously have no way of knowing, and I'm not asking any of them to do this. But just imagine how many more people are listening and are enjoying that, too, who are just lurking. So that's always been my focus, whether I realized it or not. And I plan to continue to foster that. You know, I had somebody tell me that I needed to start beating more games. Because people have been waiting years for games on the next list. And I'm like, you need to understand that that's not my MO and it never has been. I'm not here to beat games. If it happens, great. But it's not my focus. Nintendo? And I'm not going to fucking change that for anybody. <laughs> like for anybody. I don't care who, who it is. Do, 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 do. I will do my best to get through the list, but since day one of the inception of that list, I've told people there is no guarantees I will ever get through these games, but I will do my best. So long as it continues to foster what it is that I enjoy about this place. Street Fighter getting all the love, Diablo coming soon. It's already out. Is my understanding. Or maybe that's early access, but someone said earlier today 600,000 people were watching Diablo 4 today. So I figured it was out already. Mm -hmm. Vanishing Tile Room. At the end where it hits a Tie's Point. I don't know what a Tie's Point is. I've only been in there once and I died immediately. Mm -hmm. ba -da -da -do -do. Yeah, Chibi, it's wild. How many times you have to die to find everything? La Mulana, favorite thing to watch. Oh, man. Interesting. There's a few people you're like, who is this? Why and when did I follow them? Oh, that happens to me, too. Yeah. I'll see someone live. I'm like, I don't know this person. And it's usually because, like, I saw them say something cool on Twitter or in another chat. Followed them and then just never saw them live, you know, until I f couldn't remember who they were anymore. That's usually what it ends up being. Because I definitely follow people if I see them in a chat and I think that they're interesting, you know? The big hooks for you on any channel, honesty. I know not everybody wants to hear this stuff. That's fine. I'm not asking them that they have to. But I am telling them that that's the reality of this community. <laughs> Is that I will sit here like this in a game forever while I talk about things sometimes. Because I think that that's more important to focus on. And with ADHD, I can't do both at the same time. Not really. Mm, 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 mm. Whatever the streamer feels passionate about. It could be jank, could be triple A, as long as they're having fun. I think a big problem with me there, and something I've learned, is that I basically, to put it bluntly, have a resting bitch face. <laughs> I look at my VODs all the time, and I recommend any streamer do this. If you're not doing this, you are... And you are actually interested in growing, you are good fucking luck, I guess is the best way to put it. Like, I look, and it just looks like I'm not having fun. I'm like, what the fuck? When I know, like, I could think in the moment, like, in exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> like, when I'm focused, I'm like... Like, this, this is my face when I'm focused. <laughs> it probably looks a little off-putting. <laughs> Maybe a little intimidating, but damn. Like, I'm into it, you know? It's like a consternation. I bet that scares people off. 
Because I've gone to channels and be like, wow, this person doesn't look like they're having fun. But I usually stick around and see what happens. You know? So, I don't know. Maybe that's part of it. Something to learn. I try to force myself to smile more. Because I went my whole life avoiding it because of my teeth. You know? It's like a social... What do you call it? Like a... I don't know. A defense mechanism? Because when I was a kid, I would just get made fun of all the time. Then I got to college. Oh, man. That was so eye-opening. Like to come in to see Stramos scolding at the game and popping AV in like Tere Hela Constipatid. Very good. Thank you, Dermis. Yeah. Constipation face. Very important to grow a channel. <laughs> So yeah, like every day, made fun of as a kid for my teeth, right? Got to college, eye-opening. I went four years without a single comment. I'm not even kidding. Four years. And the comment came from a friend. And when I told him that I went four years without anyone ever making fun of me about it, he thought I was lying. So I stopped hanging out with him. <laughs> Fuck that guy in particular. But um bum bum but So that's why I don't smile as much as I think I should. And it is another thing that I'm working on. I did this. Look, I know I'm behind on chat. Thank you for your patience. I'm like way behind. I got too much shit to say. Okay? And I know I'm behind. I will read your messages. So please have patience. But that whole smiling thing is why I put this here. That is order of priority. That is the order of priority that I need to do things and why one of the things that I'm pushing this year and that's where all the ADHD like medicine attempts are coming from because I need this visual reminder or I forget I just do literally forget forget if this isn't here I forget so I don't know maybe it sounds like fucking idealistic hogwash I don't know <clears throat> Do, 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 do. Ooh, yuck. Shaku, please. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Nah, nah. You still stream way too many games, but you schedule them so viewers can hop on each of those days they want to. So I guess J Self, the most Im one of the most important things you need to be able to identify as a streamer is can you describe what you do in one sentence and make it sound unique? And that's something I wrestle with every year for seven years. If the answer is no, then you have no focus and people aren't going to be able to understand or conceptualize what it is you do. What have I boiled this one down to? I think I called it just ch or gaming stream dis or just chatting disguised as gaming stream, which is mostly true, right? It makes it sound like we don't play games here, but we do. We just do it slowly. <laughs> it's like me and Ape at D. We're the same vibe that way. Do 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 do. It's more enjoyable to watch the streamers having fun with what they're doing. Yeah, I agree. I think that's very true. There might be a lot of people waiting for me to beat games, but it's probably like two people per game. Maybe. I don't have any way of discovering that. You know? But I think two is a pretty low ball number when I see 25 to 50% drops when I play off the wall retro games that nobody knows. Do, 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 do. Yeah, same fairly. That's why I won't be doing D4. I personally am just ethically opposed to giving Blizzard any money. But I'm also ethically opposed to telling any of you what you should do with your money, right? So you all who are excited for Diablo 4 have bought and or will buy and enjoy it. I hope you do, honestly. I really do. That's it. Third room where the towels start exploding behind me. Oh. Yeah, tell me what you were going for there.
Dane, you tend to very quickly hit the follow button if someone you like watching says, check this out. That's because the follow button is how you see if you'll like a channel. Yeah, I'm glad there's no time limit here. I think it's true, Azure. I think I do have an intimidating, just like focused face. Oh, hi, I watch. How are you, miss? How's it going? I mean, as you can see, I'm behind on channel. Let me go ahead and try and skip ahead a little bit. We must have no facial expressions at all. They'll give us wrinkles. <laughs> oh, no. You have straight and stiff posture because height insecurity from when you were younger. Oh, my posture's really bad. I notice myself doing this a lot on my days off, and I have to be like... Like, just force myself back. You're the whiteboard at the base of your monitor, but not enough room for me. But I like that idea. Hardware good, hardware fine, but first take care of head. Yes. Yes. On a daily basis, you're told you need to smile more. See, that's different, though. That's different. Nobody's allowed to fucking tell you that except you. Right? I'm telling myself that. Not anyone else. If anyone told me that, I probably wouldn't trust them anymore. Mm -mm -mm. That comment feels scuzzy regardless of context. Yeah, I agree. What would you say you do here? <laughs> 15 minutes of actual real work on a given week. Yeah. <laughs> such a good movie yeah he's got a hell of a good pomp there doesn't he oh yeah Dave for sure speaking of hardware I finally made the investment chat who can guess what I finally invested in some of you may know if you're in that discord let's see let's see your guesses What this phenomenon do? Strimmer talks about streaming and their stream life journey, among other things, yeah. You don't really have a great line for that? Most people don't. It's not easy to do. It takes years to figure it out for a lot of people. Some people get it right away. I noticed I watch. Yeah, it's good to see you. Sorry, sometimes you ramble a lot. Please never apologize for that. All right? The only time it's disruptive is if you're not passing the vibe check, you know? Like, there's some people that treat other channels like their own soapbox, and that shit I have no patience for. Neither does most people, you know? You want to pontificate? Run your own fucking channel. Uh, no. You want to be silly? You want, you want memes, right? You want to you wanna converse with the rest of the community? Fuck yeah. Foster that. Do more of that. <laughs> but yeah, if you're talking to someone else, I'll probably scroll past if I need to. It's not personal. It's just it's not a conversation I'm in at the time, right? Penis! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wasn't ready for that. One sentence is brutal and necessary. It's called an elevator pitch. Let's just say you met the CEO of Twitch. And he said, if you can convince me in one sentence why I should promote your channel, what do you say, right? It's an elevator pitch. Up. You need to do it. Friendly neighborhood streamer strives to make the world a brighter place through entertainment. To start. I like it. It doesn't tell me much, to be honest, but... At least it gives me an idea of your values. But here's the sad cynicism about it. The amount of times that I've seen shitty people on the internet have things like positivity and good vibes in their bios is in the hundreds. <laughs> it's a start. Like I said, it's a start, right? Don't throw it out. Find a way to make it better. Find a way to make it better. Let's see. I watched as Mr. Shaku says a second PC. I have three. 
A mixer just for Mog? Love the idea. Love it. Little dummy mixer for Mog. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Plushy mixer for Mog. Oh, it's such a good idea. I love that. God, I wish that was a thing. You've now popped into Discord for a while. You have no clue. Oh, okay. Kenman, what's up? Chat interaction key, talking to people playing the room rather than talking to the game. Let's see, did anyone else guess as to what I invested in? Get Mog a Behringer. <laughs> I have a spare mixer that's a Behringer, but I swapped it out years ago because it was giving me issues. But it's there in the closet in case this thing ever blows up. Please don't. Mackie, do your thing. Stay good and true for many more years because it was spendy. You're watching a streamer. Some guy came in and was like, uh, streamer, could you watch your language? My adopted daughter is watching with me now. I've had that happen. I've had that happen. And it's really like, like effectively, I harshly responded. I was like, fuck no. I'm not babysitting your children for you. This is clearly not the community for you. Go somewhere else. <laughs> no. I'm not going to change who I am or my values and tell everyone else in this community that they have to do the same to faci facilitate one person. It's, it's, it's disgusting entitlement. Yeah, I feel you there, Kemen. Plushy cat bed that looks like a mixer. Yeah, honestly, I wish I had that now. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I don't have that on iWatch. I don't think I've had that on in five or six years. It drives too many people away. Yo, Headness, thank you. Can you please cater your scream to me specifically the main character of Twitch chat? Thanks in advance. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, you got it. That'll be uh, twenty thousand uh, dollars. You can use uh, Streamlabs tips, or you know, you can go direct to my PayPal. I don't think anyone would fault me if someone dropped twenty G and we're like, "Yeah, tailor the stream to me today." I would find a way to make that shit ridiculous and fun for all of you. <laughs> I guarantee that I would be able to spin that. <laughs> Like, hey, everyone, someone gave me $20,000 to stream for them today. We're going to have a good time. I don't think anybody would have a problem with that. <laughs> Honestly, I think you're all pretty reasonable people. Anyway, yeah, I watched got it right. She got it right. As far as the investment. She nailed it. First guess. Couple of streams from time to time they say they're 18 plus. One even says if you so much as joke about being a minor, you will be banned. That's correct. That's not their stream. That's Twitch TOS. If you just jokingly say that you're under the age of 13, there are bots on Twitch that will nuke your fucking account. Not ban you from the channel, they will delete your account. Because that's Twitch TOS, and I've seen it happen before. So don't do it. I'm not kidding about that. Don't do it. <laughs> Middle data point. Yo, welcome, by the way. Yeah. Middle data point's right. That's TOS. Right. Fairly. Yeah, same. If it was a friend of mine that had that happen to, I'm there. I don't care what they do. I am there for them. <laughs> you got to celebrate the wins, you know, of, the, of your friends and whatnot. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Twinchy is twinchy. We swear more than once every 10 minutes your video gets knocked down and priorities for promotion. Is that YouTube? Is that YouTube? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You said YouTube algorithm. I was going to say that doesn't sound right for Twitch. Yeah, no, you're right. Yeah. They walked back a little bit on the demonetization on it, but yeah, it does harm the algorithm. Hey, 
error 3000. Oh no. Why am I getting notifications? Twitch, what do you want? Oh, gift subs expiring. Thanks. You remember when this was a that other room stream? What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Dude, dude, dude. Oh, okay, Ryan, yeah. Yeah, uh, the under 18 thing is a channel rules thing. Mm -mm. I tell people just... Don't tell us what your age is unless you're... I don't know. I mean, it's just better not to, but... We had somebody do it earlier in here that was like... Sometime early, I think it was like the beginning of this year, and they were like 15 or something. And I was like, we... They were cool, they were asking a lot of very naive questions, right? And I was like, okay, something's a little weird here. Like, they were respectful, they were being nice, but they were asking naive questions, and when I specifically said, don't tell us how old you are, they did. And I didn't have a fucking choice at that point. So, goodbye. It sucks, but I had to do it. Cause like, you know, even though my channel isn't, I don't think it's specifically marked as mature. I wouldn't say this is a channel for kids. You know, I wouldn't recommend that adults who have kids in this community would let them watch me. I mean, but that's their decision, right? That's their decision. It's up to them to raise their kids, not me. But some of the things I talk about here are pretty heavy. You know, like my ADHD struggles, and I certainly don't censor my language, you know? So, yeah. The only thing I'm really kind of leery about is I don't really ever go into details about, like, lewd stuff or allow that, because it just makes me uncomfortable, like, that kind of stuff. Like, and it's, I'm never going to, like, want to make people feel like they can't be themselves, but I just don't ever want details, you know? Do, 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 The other room in Star Trump. Oh, 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 okay, I get you, yeah. I know, we moved a room. <laughs> if you're under 18, don't tell anyone. When you're over 18, also don't tell anyone. I mean, honestly, like, if you're in your 20s or whatever, you know, or higher, it's whatever. I think it's just safer to ignore it for the most part. You can't look, look Cujo. Let? Cujo's your dog, isn't it? <laughs> it's your dog, isn't it? <laughs> I think Cujo's cool. Yeah, me and Cujo, Cujo we go back, so. <laughs> oh no. Cujo's your dog. <laughs> Get the hell out of here. Ugh. Doo -doo, doo -doo 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 -doo. I ain't child friendly. I don't think so. I don't know though. It's not something I've ever really examined. It's honestly a good question, data point. I don't, I don't know. Again, I think it's up to the parents, right? But if someone comes in here and says they're under 18, I'm probably going to ban them. Just out of principle. But if someone here has, you know, if there are parents here that have kids that are under 18, that are like, I don't know, whatever. Like, as long as they're over 13. I don't know. I can't make that decision for them, right? I'm not them. Like, it's up to them to raise them with their kids. But I, I think they should at least be informed about the things that I talk about. You'd mark 18 plus anyway, Dane? Yeah, I think that's up to each individual streamer for sure. No, no. Oh, that sucks, Dave. Yeah, it's a bummer. Yeah, I get it. You have to. Because, like, as a streamer, like, especially when we're contracted under partnership, we are required to enforce the TOS. Or we are culpable for it. So, what do I talk about? Um... Wow, what a great question. 
chat, you want to give me a hand here? You know how bad my memory is, right? Honestly, I talk about just about anything that comes to mind, and I don't censor or filter it. Um, so I go into real discussions about my struggles with ADHD. I'm not afraid to talk about adult topics if they are more, I guess, sexual in nature, but I never go into details because I, I am uncomfortable with that. Um, lewd jokes are made sometimes, usually not by me, but I play along because, you know. Let's talk about potatoes. I mean, I like potatoes. I'm, you know, I'm half Irish, so. Oh, <laughs> uh, man. Kids these days only know this Star Tropics room. <laughs> Yo, broski, what up, dude? You are not. Aren't you only like two years older than me, Mister, Sir? Yeah, Chad, I invested in a Mister. The price was ridiculous, but I've been saving money for a long time to get one. So. There's nothing offensive here, but we like a certain more mature vibe and don't stray from mature topics or foul language. Yeah. That's a good way of putting it. Do, do, do. You'd say this is an 18 plus channel just because some heavy topics get discussed. Some stuff that the kiddo should not be hearing. It, you know, that I mean, it's possible. Again, it's up to the parents. But I can never see anyone say they're under a certain age here. Or I have to do something about it. And it's like, you know, I'll say the same thing I used to when I worked security. Don't turn me into the bad guy, right? Don't make me be the bad guy, because I'm beholden to certain things, you know? Usually, at that career, people understood what I was saying to them. And they would calm the fuck down, you know? <clears throat> <laughs> I had some pretty funny coworkers when people got rowdy like that. One guy was acting a fool. And he asked my coworker, he's like, he's like, why you gotta yell at me like that? And he's like, why you gotta keep making stupid decisions? <laughs> the guy just shut up. <laughs> I mean, good question. <laughs> he said it like in the middle of a crowd, like it was at a baseball game. So he's surrounded by hundreds of people and they all just started laughing at him. <laughs> Dude got humiliated straight. <sighs> Broski, thank you for 62 freaking months, by the way. Damn. One of the OGs. Dude, you were here on your other account. <clears throat> That's a noisy bowling ball. Also, why is there a bowling ball in here? Ooh, I want to get that. There's a giant bowling ball in here. This game is so goofy. Oh, jeez. What the? Ah! Oh. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Oh, too far. Nice. I didn't take a breath. I didn't take a breath. Let me kill a snake so I can read the rest of the chat here. We talk about my ADHD. But the topics we talk about, goals for myself, what I see in my own failures, how I operate this channel about Twitch. Yeah, that's all true. Do, 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 do. So I got a mister. For those of you who don't know what that is, it's an FPGA. <clears throat> it's a little box with some kind of chipset on it that works as a hardware emulator. And there are several hundred what are called emulation cores on it that can emulate via hardware, much like a flash cart, systems, consoles and PC operating systems. So the main draw for me is I finally will have access to TurboGrafx-16, CD, PC Engine, CD, Amiga, Commodore 64, like all that stuff, right? All of that, I'll finally have access to. I'll also have a really easy way to play just about any game at any time other than like I don't think N64 is working on it. 
I think Saturn's a work in progress, but I think like anything PS1 and earlier works on it. So that could make for some interesting raffle nights, for example. We could use that for raffle nights, multi-system raffle nights, which there are plenty of you who are fans of a raffle nights, myself included. Being able to open it to almost any system, I think, is worth the investment, you know? Among other reasons, so. How old are you, Broski? You're like 43, right? Something like that. Mm -mm -mm. So yeah, it. I, I wouldn't have been able to buy this if it wasn't for all of you. Um, you know, this is something I was saving for for months and months. Like I wanted to buy one a full year ago, but they weren't available. Because <clears throat> there's a specific chipset that it uses that's stupid expensive and always out of stock. I don't really know the details. The technical details are kind of beyond me. Um, but suffice it to say that a uh, streamer friend, Owl Anonymous, got a st stock of 20 of those chipsets and recently opened an order. <clears throat> I think he still has some. If you are interested and you go to his Discord, you can get those details. Also, I need more water. I can feel my throat getting dry. So just uh, give me a sec here. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's in the spot. Asparagus? My roommate makes good asparagus. <clears throat> like with this orange cream sauce oh man this stuff is amazing it has a lot of potassium in it no i didn't know that another thing about working security leave a message when you're calling an apartment's renter wait what i don't wait what does that mean Respect security guards, they respect you, and sometimes they'll play with Cujo. Nice. <clears throat> yeah, long time, broski. Do, 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 do. They're just doing their job. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done the job. Five years? Almost? Almost five years. Parents of young kids would vibe here more than the actual kids, especially when talking, reminiscing about retro games. Right. Yeah, I like the paw screen. He gets chibi and he holds the sign. <laughs> That's cool. Made to sell guides, design points. Yeah, this does seem to have that. It does. A mist, it's like you need to make my room more moist. No, good God. In the summer, it's just muggy all the time. Also, no, those are called, I think, humidifiers. <laughs> <laughs> Ultimate emulator machine. Yeah. You know me, I don't really like using emulation, but again, I say that I will if I have to. And getting my hands on a recap Turbo Duo or PC Engine Duo, and then an Amiga and a Commodore and maybe whatever, right? There's just some systems that I'm priced out of, and almost everyone else is, too. Same for- I don't have space, either. Like, where would I even put them? Like, f actual physical space I don't have for it. You can make me play Cho and Iki. I already have. Do -do 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 -do. We have played Weirder, yeah. You're 44 in a few months? Nice. It's fantastic for Amiga emulation. Yeah? Okay, that's good. I've heard the Amiga library is really, really robust. I've seen, like, Ash said hi, Amiga Bill. Um, I think a little bit fractal my mic. Dip into Amiga games. It's a big library. There's a lot there. So that could be fun, just to tinker with that. It was like running on the real hardware. Nice. That's good to hear. She makes asparagus. Is she God? I don't know. You'd have to ask her. 
do, 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 do. You'd like to hear about my experiences with it. I'll let you know when I get one. I haven't heard yet when it's going to be made. Because, I mean, the order was just placed this weekend. So, Mr. R9 is a Mr. Yeah. Ash said hi. Andy Gaming Network. Andy Social Network, right? Um, I don't know. There's a lot of people I know that have one. I just don't remember offhand who. Yeah, it's emulating the hardware. Not the software. It's still emulation, but... I can at least route it the same way I do my retro console, so it'll be mostly seamless of a transition for me if it's for systems I don't have or for raffle nights. Looks like ads are about to kick in, so you non-subs, we're going to see up to three minutes of ads. We run these every hour on the half hour now. Why? So we can all relax at the same time. I know when ads come in and no one gets pre-rolls. Ever. You don't get pre-rolls when I do it this way. There we go. Is that that's goofy bot still working? It is, okay. You bought a copy of Lunar Silver Star Story Complete. That's never been played. Jeez, how much was that? <laughs> that sounds like it would have been a lot of money. Wow. <laughs> Mr. Mister? That's a song from the 80s, isn't it? <clears throat> or no. Is that a song? No, that's a group. It's a group. Yeah, Dave. Yeah. It's just like we're at that point where a lot of these systems are so old now and so many of them were just destroyed or deteriorated that it's just not worth it. Software emulation. The timings are subject to the timings of the system. Hardware, assuming the FPGA is fast enough, can exactly match timings of the original hardware. Ooh, there's the draw. Cool. Security for an apartment called one night while you were at work. They didn't leave a message. When you got home that morning and found they had let somebody in to your unit. Oh, wow. That sucks. Why the hell did they do that? <clears throat> I think another thing that would be nice about the Mister is certain, like, retro PC games. Because it has been a real hassle getting some of those work to the point where I'm like, I would just have to emulate this game. But I feel like that's going to solve some of those issues. Maybe. I don't know. It's something to look into. For the most part, the retro PC is really nice to use, and I prefer it whenever possible. Do, 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 do. Mm. But that's another part of what I was discussing earlier. <clears throat> You're increasingly hesitant to mod your consoles. Because decent ones are getting harder to find. I mean, the thing about old retro consoles is most of them don't need to be modded. Like, really, all you would need to mod is an NES and an N64. That's it. They don't... None of the others need a mod. Most of them do RGB natively. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Like, Super Nintendo, PS1, PS2 to a degree, um, Saturn, Genesis... Uh, what else? What am I forgetting? I think Master System does even. Those all do RGB natively. <clears throat> oh, PAL NTSC modding. Oh, God, yeah. That's a whole other ballgame. I wouldn't know anything about that. Also, ads are done. Thank you, everyone, for your patience with those. <laughs> No, I wouldn't want to run those on the Mr. iWatch. Unless, well, I guess I might not be understanding here. 
Oh, look at this room. Holy smokes. I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> <laughs> what was I saying? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. This... I don't like this room. Can I change its direction? No. Damn. You can't. Okay. Two hundred <clears throat> plus fifty in shipping, twenty-five in fees to get into Australia. <sighs> so wait a minute, you're in Australia. Do you have a, a NTSC console? Do you have an NTSC PS One? Because I don't think it's gonna work on a PAL PS One or rerun properly. I hope you have one of those. Oh, see how close that was. <laughs> oh, God. Ooh, that's not where I expected that to go. Okay. This is a nice song. Baseball bat! Huh. No switch. <clears throat> Can't go in that door, I guess. All your consoles are NTSC because you're imported. Ah, got it. Yeah, you good. Using a Mr. Emulated Amiga is not a bad thing at all. Yeah. To get decent Amiga like you had, the Mr. is far more affordable. Right. Yeah, it just there wasn't any reason for me to try and find the space for all of that and then pay the premium for just that. Like... I think when I priced it, getting a recap Turbo Duo or PC Engine CD and an Amiga would have been easily close to, if not more than a thousand. No. So finding space for that and paying the price, like, no. <laughs> like, just no. Absolutely not, right? It's not reasonable at this point. <laughs> All right, so this was just to get the baseball bat. NTSC games run on PS3s. Yeah, at that point, it was all 60 hertz, from my understanding. <clears throat> you remember this area? Uh-oh. Dane. Dane's, Dane is conveying right now, but he's not telling me. He's not telling me what he needs to be telling me. All right, let's look for secrets again. It's not working. I blame Dane Bread. Open! There's no secrets that I can see. Do 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 do. Oh fuck! I just got the wand. Hold on. Hold on. Let's try this. I knew it. <laughs> Stupid ghost. I remember that last dungeon. I kept doing that. <laughs> yep. The ghost in the wall that you can't see unless you use the magic wand. This game is ruthless. Jeez, shock here. Ooh, I see, Broken Crow. This game's extremely mean for no reason. Oh, yeah. Ooh, what's that? I don't know. I don't know how to use it. It's those potions. Wait a minute. Huh? Is this another ghost situation? <laughs> Wait a minute. I can't get down there. <sighs> Do -do -do -do. They restore life fully. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, there you go. There it is. Yeah, you're right. Damn it. 
Well, I don't know how to get down there. Might not be able to. You might have to come there from a different direction. <laughs> you want to play this again? Did you stream this, Broski? You did, didn't you? Also, go follow Old Man Broski if you don't. It's a good place to hang out when, um, when I'm done. I think he doesn't typically start until after I'm done. <clears throat> Which is like, what, afternoon for where he lives in the Netherlands? But it's like 9 a.m. Eastern-ish, somewhere around there. It's a great time. Sequel isn't as good. Oh, that's too bad. <clears throat> Wait, so it was some person, Shaku, that didn't even live there that you didn't know? What the fuck were they doing in your apartment? Like, <clears throat> what the hell? <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm down in here. Unless anybody knows anything, I don't. Doesn't seem to be anything in here. Dude. Oh, that's a cute emote. What's up, Nintend... Nintend Nat? Nintend Nat. How do I say your name? I'm so sorry. Everyone gets my name wrong, too. That's the best part about it, honestly. PC will not be not overheating in a few more days. Is your AC in that room not cutting it? Right. Yeah, I, I get that part, Dom. What I'm asking is why someone he didn't know was doing that in the first place. <laughs> Nat is all good. Right on. Thank you. Here we go. I was hoping that the wand would respawn. You know, we would be so lucky. All right, here we go. Whoa! I thought that was going to have a build-up time. All right, let's go down here. Snack! <sighs> All right, I'm fine. Everything's good. Everything's totally good and fine and normal and okay. So, you know. Ooh. Before I go in there, check the walls, right? Because we've seen one of these work before when there was no shadow. And that was rude, to put it mildly. <laughs> it was rude, okay? <sighs> there was zero conveyance that it was a wall you could walk through. All right. What's unpopular? Do 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 do. Oh, the the sequel isn't as good. Yeah, I haven't heard that too often. I've heard a lot of people say it's better, but who knows? Bad case and stock cooler. Oh, you mean the PC is overheating due to internals, not externals. I should have assumed that. <laughs> yeah, good luck with it. I hope you can fix that, man. I, I think it's because I'm hot and it's getting hot in Chicago. And so I'm just assuming everything is ambient temperature at this point. You know, it just, it was an assumption. <clears throat> Do, 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 do. What the hell are these things? Chickens? Ah. Okay, cool. Let's go. Oh, it's bowling ball time again. <laughs> what a goofy game. Uh. Oh. Okay, that was close. What? Well, now we have a decision. Do we go left or up? 
Okay, let's go. Okay. Uh oh. I hate this room already. <laughs> oh man, no, not these guys. Oh, these guys are the worst. Okay, okay. Dead. Yeah, too close. <clears throat> this game is. And then you lose all your items too. Like we see. All of them. They're all gone now. Oh man, we're all the way back here now. Did I plot out the rooms? No, not at all. I wonder why these are longer. That's kind of sus. Well, nothing coming of it. Uh-oh. Okay, we're good. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Oh, it just freezes it. Okay. I thought it was stuck. <laughs> I thought I ruined everything. Ugh, it just stops. Okay. Wait, yo, monkey. Oh, crap. I forgot about these guys. Oh, really? That was a bad snack right there. Everybody's favorite sound. Beep, beep. <laughs> oh, man. Make it stop. All right. What was to the left? I don't remember. Oh, it was a potion, wasn't it? I need that potion because that sound needs to go away yesterday. Right? Was a potion in here? Oh, it was the bat. The potion I think was in the other room. <laughs> That's so mean. Putting that guy right there. And you can't hit him unless you use the wand, even if you know he's there. You have to do it. Oh my god, Chupon, please. <clears throat> there it is. Yes! Make it stop. wild shaku video and audio still play but chat checked out for a nap or something really that's been happening to some people lately yeah yeah i've been seeing that not on my end but from others only baseball hat restored health the sound in star tropics 2 the beep sound is worse what the fuck just happened <laughs> what was that all right. I guess I gotta live with whatever that was. Do, 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 do. Come here, bat. Oh, dang it. Come here, bat. <clears throat> well, that bat's a little sporadic, huh? There we go. There we go. Do 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 do. do. <clears throat> I outran the ball, so I hit it and actually ran into it faster than it was moving. That's that's Nintendo hard, isn't it? <laughs> Let's kill these duck chicken things. 
Eh, they're pretty basic. Alright. <clears throat> I could go up. Hell with it. Let's do it. So now we're here again. And that just lets me go back. Alright, so this is just a dead end. There's, I guess, no gimmick to this room that I can see. <clears throat> So I actually have to backtrack here. Go. <sighs> All right, here we go. Go. Oh. Okay, we got this. All right, what's in here? A block. There's a block. There's just a block. It's a pretty basic room, but now we're in the room with the, the, the Biblos, if you like Final Fantasy Tactics or whatever the hell they are called. <laughs> Alright, here we go. No! Stupid bats. You just jerks. I'm gonna use this. This is safer. Play it safe. Just play it safe. This ain't a race. There's no timer. Right? It's not a Mario game. Okay. <clears throat> okay. There we go. Oh, okay. Back and forth! The other the wall 57 times for a secret in my room. Trust me, the kid in the school bus told me. Oh, yeah, that was the same kid that told me, uh, how to, uh, how to, um, what was it? Fuck. Yeah, he told me how to revive General Leo in the world of ruin. <laughs> Remember all those dumb rumors? We're old games back then. How to get Shang Wong, the secret character from that. Electronic Gaming Monthly April Fool's article that was actually pretty convincing. That kid told me how to get the Impro Bot. Yeah, that one, yeah. He told me how to get Mew under the truck. Yeah, Mew under the truck, I think, was the most popular one, wasn't it? That was the most popular non-rumor. Uh-oh, this isn't looking good. Oh man, really? Nothing. Well, how do I open that door? How do I open that door? This, this is about another ghost room, isn't it? This is how uh, I'm gonna science. <laughs> Fuck you, ghost. Wait, is this the same room with the? It's the same ghost room. Well, now I'm very confused. Doo -doo -doo. I need to go back to that room with the bats and kill them all. That's the only thing in play I think I have here. Purple guy room is where you want the wand? Oh, okay. Let's see if it'll let me go back. Oh, shit. <laughs> they respawned, fuck. Oh, they do so much damage. Oh, I'm so sorry for the sounds. I hate when you try to turn around and he actually moves forward. That fucks you up. Go! No, stop! Oh, I hate when they're stacked. They share damage or split it. Not share, split it. You serious? Are you fucking serious? Look at that. <laughs> That's some shit right there. Wow. 
The BS method of getting the imp robot involved in the fanatics tower. I never heard that rumor. I'd love to learn about that one. Moving that truck before boarding the SSN by having strength. Yeah, yeah, there was all these like impossible tricks. Do, 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 do. I remember doing it as a kid, getting strength for the SSN through like missing no glitches from what I remember and just being pissed that it didn't work still. <laughs> I can't remember how I did it, but as a kid, I did it. There was a lot of glitching involved with uh, missing no back then. Totally serious, bro. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Let's see if we can redirect this. Nope. Okay, how do I want to play this? Not like that. <laughs> GG. <sighs> All right. Let's keep trying. <clears throat> do, 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 do. I mean, yeah, you can now, I watch, but that wasn't a known thing back then. I don't think people knew that until, like, at the earliest of mid-2000s, but I think it was closer to 2010. I don't remember. But it was not... Like, it was a rumor in the 90s, and I don't think finding out the glitch to get Mew actually happened until many years later, which is still amazing. Like, at this point... Ah, oh, fuck. I think I'm dead. Go for it. Yeah, it was worth it. <clears throat> dun, dun. Secret heart where? At the entrance, what, of the dungeon? I don't see anything about the walls in here, so it must be a different room. I didn't need to do that. I might be able to get two. But that little skip. Fuck yeah. How about that? <clears throat> that was dope. There were people using no GB to try and learn how the glitches that were known were cool. That's some real low level stuff, huh? All right, we're gonna go left because I think there was a potion or something, right? Oh, it was hearts. I guess I didn't really need that, to be honest. Eh, whatever. Now I got more hearts. Easy enough. So this one looks like it's pointing down. That I No, don't go down. Just don't do it. Whoop, whoop. Bedtime? What does that mean? You just made that word up, didn't you? What the fuck's up bedtime? Wow, they dropped an actual heart. That almost never happens. <clears throat> what other goofy rumors were from back then? I know there was plenty around Eris. Or Eris. An FF7. I won't say what, because there's still to this day people that haven't played. Oh. He was trying to sell that emulator as a dev kit. So did somebody like steal his code or something, or did he just put it out there and expected people to pay for it? I don't. I don't know. Tactic said the dumb used 99 Phoenix Downs on Tita thing. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I did hear that one. Yeah. 
Ooh, I see. I watch. That doesn't seem like a very wise play on his part. Do 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 do. But that does remind me of something, chat. And most of you would remember this, but not everybody. But back in the 90s and early 2000s, there were paid emulators. <laughs> like, you had to buy them. Ugh. I think one was called Bleem for the PS1. I think there was one for N64. I don't remember the name of that one. Most people didn't bother. For the most part. You know, because there was almost always a free alternative. He sold it online, mailed it to people on discs. Bleem is the biggest example. Yeah, I think they got sued from what I remember, but... That is a long time ago, and I really... That's some hazy memory on my part, so... Take with a grain of salt. Why didn't he hop that? <laughs> It's a gap! Why did he jump the gap? Oh. Son of a... Was that a glitch? Did I jump too early? What happened there? I don't know. <clears throat> Sony sued over Bleem. They did, didn't they? Yeah, okay. Bleem won, but the legal proceedings bankrupted them. Was that the case that set the precedent of legal emulation? That was the one, wasn't it? You didn't believe in the tropics. Oh my goodness. Listen. <laughs> there you go. That little skip lets me get two hearts each time. That's really nice. Very good, very good. Yeah, that, I remember that now. That was a huge deal. Bleem won at the cost of their company, but they set the legal precedent in North, well, in US, that emulators were legal. <clears throat> that really backfired for game developers. But, you know, I think that was one of the rare cases where when it comes to, you know, piracy copyright stuff the court's got it right <laughs> it shouldn't be illegal right like i understand that the vast majority of people are using them for piracy right obviously we can't discuss how to facilitate that but as grown-ass adults we understand why most people use them but if you make them illegal you make so many use cases that are like <laughs> like essential for industries to operate. You make those illegal. <clears throat> do, 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 do. PS Emu Pro was the alternative at the time. EPS XE was a bit later. That's the one I used in college, that EP one. I think I actually used that on stream years ago. Lots of companies make emulators for their own stuff. Right, which that wasn't in question. But I think lots of companies make emulators for other stuff too, right? As a necessity. Bleem was more legal than how PSMU Pro worked since they had their own reproduction of the PS1 BIOS. Ooh. So they reverse engineered it. PSMU Pro required people to provide the Sony BIOS, which was mostly just pirated. Hmm. Wild, Andrew. That shit's wild, man. Ah! I think the way those spawn is RNG. Ah! Thought that rat was gonna get me. Uh-oh. Snacks! Oh, we're good. We got strong ball. Spike ball. <clears throat> the powerful spike ball will protect us. 
Fukisake. Okay. That's a new beverage I haven't tried. I'm gonna have to try that Fukisake there. Do, 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 do. I have a copy of the BIOS for my actual PS1. Is that what you put on here? On this thing, right? You, you dumped the BIOS legally onto an external device. It was this, wasn't it? <clears throat> Which I can't, I remember you said this is like a down the road potential, like integration with external software, like crowd control stuff. Right, isn't that? No, that's a way to boot unmodded PS1 consoles. Oh, okay. Wait, where's the copy? Did you... The copy of the BIOS... I don't remember where that is, then. <laughs> I don't actually know where you put that, then. Spend an hour doing your nails and in one brain fart put a huge gash. I mean, you can retouch it up, right? I don't know. I guess that's probably easier said than done. I, to be honest, I'm talking out of my ass here. I'm sorry. <laughs> I've never, I've never tried it, so I don't actually know the process or how involved it is. You wish the PS1 and 2 were a little more resilient? I mean, I've had my PS2 for 20 years, so I, maybe that's the exception. Do, 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 do. It should have been on an SD card or something. It might be in that box. I think it's probably, the SD card's probably in that box then. Cause I, like when you gave me the X station, it didn't, from what I remember, I don't think it came with an SD card. I had to get my own, which is what I put the whole library on. I think, I don't remember, it was a while ago. Face palm, Mozzie. That was the one we changed, remember? You can retouch it, but the gas is huge. It would take another 30 minutes. I mean, if it's just the one finger, like, you're not out of commission, right? Oh, you want to go to bed. Gotcha. Dude, you're never going to remember? I don't know what to tell you, man. That's a you problem. <laughs> PS2 Slim was good. My big PS2 still works. I'd say I'm unlucky. I mean, there's a part that's broken on it. It's just that the the AV port is loose because a piece of plastic broke on it years ago. I was leaning back in a chair years ago when I was much heavier and it broke. And the back of the chair with me falling landed on the AV cable, the PS2 that was behind me on a table and just broke the port. <clears throat> But it still works. It didn't damage the system at all. I just learned that I had to, like, kind of... The way to fi fix it is that I just... When the AV cable's plugged in the back of the PS2, it sags down. So I just prop it up with something under it, and it's fine. To this day, I still have to do that. Do, 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 do. Yeah, that reminds me though, Matsi's stubborn refusal. Just kidding. <laughs> his his relatable issue with the renamed emote. Um, <clears throat> I put forth an idea in Discord about emotes, and I want to hear everyone's input here, whether you like it or not. Do, 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 do. I I will put forth right here that I'm biased and I like the idea. Okay. But here's the idea, and let me show you with a screenshot so it's easier to understand visually. Because I feel like if I describe it all, it might be a wee bit confusing. Oh, I should be able to just paste this in my notepad. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, now I have a web link, which I can show on stream. And there you go. Here's the, the emote idea. 
So I've had an animated emote in Discord for years, years. Probably a year and a half. Animated smart emote. It's probably one of the most used emotes in Discord. We've never been able to utilize it as a Twitch animated emote because you only get five slots no matter no matter what. Doesn't matter how many subs you get. Five slots. So this is my idea. Remove the trash can animation. Move peak to tier one in its place. Rename that to lurk. Add the animated smart noted to tier one. Remove the old smart. Remove 100, <clears throat> which we don't use anymore. And then commission two brand new tier one emotes. So yay or nay. So far, a lot of yeses, a few noes. But I wanted to put it to this community because not all of you use Discord, right? So I kind of want to get both sides. Both sides of that equation. <clears throat> the reason I came to the conclusion of finally making room for this is Lurk is used by few people compared to the other animated emotes. It's not the least used. The least used is my most used, which is what Smashing Chin just used there, which is shy. I use that emote probably more than any other. <laughs> so that's not going anywhere. <clears throat> but it's like Clap, Nom, and Finkies are used thousands of times a month outside of the channel. Lurk is used maybe 10% of that. Like two to 300 times a month. And then Shy even less, which is almost all me, but I don't care, I'm keeping it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, it's my most used emote, Mozzie. So, there are no right or wrong answers to this. Okay? Whether you like the idea or you don't, that's there's no wrong answer. But I would love to hear what everybody's opinion is. <clears throat> yeah, I'm assuming if you don't use Discord or you aren't in our Discord, you've never seen what I'm talking about. Um, I think I have a way to show you that, too. Let me try this. Let me try this really quick. <clears throat> I think I can right click it and open it as a web page. I can, okay. So this is what the emote actually looks like. And it's used in Discord constantly. That right there would be going in Lurk's place. <clears throat> then we would have two open tier one slots because we'd get rid of the dice and the unanimated version of this. Use peak as a lurk emote. I see a lot of people do that too. <clears throat> so yeah. This is, in Discord, I probably use this more than anything and it's not even a sub emote yet. Like it's been there for over a year. Probably close to two. <laughs> so yeah. You know? Like I spam this all the time. You should ask my mods how often I fucking use this emote when we're in like discussions about like channel ideas. It's probably annoying to them, honestly. <laughs> uh, is this smart one you put in my bios? Yes, it is, yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You're using Dan a lot. That's a good one, yeah. It's not part of that this particular discussion, but it's a good one. So yeah, we would we would remove the trash can one, put peak in its place um, as the lurk emote, and then yeah, that's that's see, smashing ten are in the same. It's not clear that it's lurking, <clears throat> not really. Like it. I think that was the biggest failing of that emote to me. Is like when people see it, they're like, what is this conveying? You'd have to look at it a lot of the time. It's good, though. But yeah, the vast majority of people in Discord said that... Where is it? Yeah, the, the votes are pretty big. But this was just this active Discord people who saw this ping because I pinged the server and voted on it. Do, 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 do. 
Peek, peek. Dun, 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 dun. So let's see. <clears throat> you can fix surface mount stuff. Hot air rework station. What is a surface mount? You met my tall, bony Dutch twin. Oh, what? <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. I guess I need water again. <clears throat> You're the most prominent user of Chunk? I don't have any way of knowing that. Yeah, it doesn't give me... Analytics, I think by design, do not give me detail or data on specific users for privacy reasons. <clears throat> so I have no way of knowing who uses what. You like peak as a bit emote. <clears throat> why? Tell me why. Explain it to me. I don't... I guess my point, my under, well, what I'm trying to say is that what's the difference to me? Like, because I obviously just get to use them all no matter what, right? I don't have that point of view. <clears throat> ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Oh, I forgot to get that, didn't I? Yeah, it's all right. We're good. <clears throat> Uh, where's the thing? How do I get out of here? <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> Where was the exit? Oh, there it was. Okay. Well, that's a noisy room. <clears throat> that's a noisy room. Scone bone video. Hello. Thank you. For the raid, what were you doing tonight? Yeah, what up, Tara? Welcome back, Scone Bone. Welcome back. Ah, crap! I didn't get the shield. Is that Rip? I think that's Rip. You need to get the shield. Yeah, okay, that's Rip. <laughs> Frick! This game is so rude. <clears throat> Scone Bone, thank you for the raid. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, everybody. How was Scum Bone Stream? Welcome, Surreal. Do, 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 do. You beat Zelda 2 for the first time and moved on to Mega Man 3, I'm assuming. <laughs> That's a 3, right? I think. All right, someone said there's a heart in here, but I don't. Oh, I see it. Fuck, wow. That's sneaky. Look at that. Boy, that would have been nice. I tell you what. <clears throat> Welcome, everybody. Yeah, GG and Zelda 2. That, especially just getting to that last passel, that gauntlet you have to go through. Last passel. Did I say passel? I meant to say palace. <laughs> Going through that gauntlet to get to the last palace? <sighs> Brutal. Brutal. And then just getting through that palace and finding, like, the secrets that you have to... Uncover just to get to the end, right? <clears throat> Rude. Do, 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 do. Holding shift on the letter. Holding shift on the. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. For the three, right? Do, 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 do. Martyr Pastel, yeah. Pastel Castle, yeah. Exactly, same. Same thing. Do, 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 do. Zelda 2? I like it. I think it's one of the weakest of the franchise. But I also really enjoy it. <clears throat> I want to play that HD version of it. That fan HD version. Should give that a shot at some point. How am I doing? How am I doing? How am I doing? Oh, I always tell people to be careful with that question. <laughs> Excuse me. Streams 
are always a vibe. They always, always make me feel better. And everything outside of it is not great. What is... Seeing like a distortion at the top of the screen. I think that's normal though. Because you're not seeing it. I cropped it. Do, 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 do. Passel! Let's go to the passel! The bit of a selfish region, you can use peak anytime once you hit that bit threshold. True. Yeah. I haven't decided what I would do in its place. Like, I could just slide all the others up. Or put the trash can one there. Unanimated in its spot, but I don't know. <clears throat> do, do. Dude, what up, Shrum? No one's ever enjoyed Zelda 2 trash game. Isn't that like literally your favorite game? <laughs> oh. Isn't that your favorite game? Shrum, man with greatest, greatest hair and chest hair on Twitch, right? He's the chest hair of retro, that Shrum. Is this better than a tank game? I don't know. They're, not really comparable. Overscan noise? Yeah, I think you're right. Don't be sorry, Tara. Never be sorry about that, okay? I just want people to realize I'm going to answer it honestly when I need to ask. <laughs> like you're you're not allowed to stop because of that. You just need to understand that I'm bluntly honest about these things. <clears throat> and a lot of people don't like that. Some code gets executed during the scan period, so it creates noise, but it's never seen on a real TV. Mm, okay. Okay. You don't know? You don't know what's your favorite? Okay. Z2 speedrun? Not a speedrunner, man. Don't want to be. Don't enjoy speedrunning. Literally takes away the reason I enjoy streaming from me. The king of chest hair? Well, I don't know if he is, but like I said, he's the chest hair of retro specifically, you know? As marketed by his local blockbuster. <clears throat> you know? It's the vibe. <laughs> so, Tara, how are you? <laughs> You should stream with your shirt off. Hey, you could do what old man Broski did. He streamed with a fucking bathrobe for like a year. And then he had the balls to tell me that he didn't have courage to wear nice clothes. I was like, dude, fuck off with that nonsense. Mister, I wore a bathrobe with my chest hanging out for a year on stream. <laughs> <clears throat> you ain't coming at me with that, Broski. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Oh, can you imagine, Orion? <sighs> can you imagine? You're great? That's good to hear. Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. Yeah, a custom embroidered bathroom. That's right. Yeah, it has like a... Your... Does it have like your channel initial, initials on it? <clears throat> Which I think is pretty cool. Dun -dun. Heart emote. What heart emote? <clears throat> This is in a Star Tropic speed run. Could you imagine? Could you imagine? <clears throat> I tried speed running on this channel years ago. Many years ago. Okay, I know how to get out of here this time. <clears throat> I think it was right here. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. <clears throat> Thought I could hit it. All right, I can't forget the shield this time. There it is. Required for next room. Come on. Come on. Why is there a giant bowling ball in here? I think that's the pressing question of our times, you know? See you later, Binary. Have a good one. All right, here we go. Reflections. Whoa! Oh, damn you. 
What a jerk. I still got spikies, though, so we're okay. <clears throat> OMB in the chat. B-M-F-O-T on the back. What's that mean? Do, 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 do. Yeah, what was I saying? I tried speedrunning years ago on Twitch because I thought I would enjoy it because I loved watching them so much. So I started learning some runs and I learned a few. I learned how to do Final Fantasy 1 on PSP, which is a really good introductory speed run. It's very easy. <clears throat> I learned uh, Dark Souls 1 caveman percent, which is all bosses with a great club and like nothing else. And also I learned Super Mario Odyssey. And that last one specifically had basically proved to me, you know, what I had already learned with the prior ones was that I could not stand learning and doing the speed runs because they were repetitive. So the novelty wore off almost immediately and <clears throat> frustrating and I couldn't read chat while I was doing them. So I was just getting bored with streams when I was doing them. So I've this it, I think the last time I tried one was like the middle of 2019. I haven't gone back. And I don't ever want to. <laughs> like I don't want to do things that make me not enjoy this. <clears throat> Dun 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 Scum Bone, did I ask you what the hell you were doing tonight? Also, did did you get a shout out? Did you get a shout out? I don't know if you did. I'm not even sure. <clears throat> uh, no, you didn't. All right, hold on. Do 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 do. There we go. What would you... I know you be, you said you beat Zelda 2, but what are you going to be doing next? Did you beat Mega Man 3, or are you going to be working on that? <clears throat> for, uh... For the uh, time being. Alright, which way did I need to go? I think left out a potion. But it also means I'd have to get through two of these things. Wait, what, Tristan? I... I lost context of what you're talking about. <clears throat> Excuse me. Dun, 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 do 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 ba ba da ba ba. But yeah, there was basically nothing about speedrun I enjoyed. <laughs> you can believe that. Not not a single thing. I didn't find any joy in it at all. So I didn't do it anymore, you know? You know, there's something I've learned over the years on Twitch is not to try and force an issue if something doesn't work out. I don't have to keep doing it. It's better to just move on quickly. <clears throat> mm -mm. Take one of the other exits and come back immediately and you only have to deal with one of those. Well, this one locks me in, but I wonder if that's true going up too. <clears throat> yeah, what's up, Ultima? You got some work to do for Mega Man 3? That's a tough game. I think a lot of people forget just how hard that game was. Like, the Wily Castle in Mega Man 3 is ruthless. <laughs> it's really difficult. <clears throat> you just pick the games from your collection next to Sonic 2 unless you get your N64 back from the modder. What kind of mod are you putting in it? Is it HDMI? Yellow Devil? Yeah, Yellow Devil is awful. You tried speedrunning with some of your favorite games like Shadow of the Colossus, Banjo-Kazooie, but there's too many games you want to experience to keep investing so much time in a single one. You know, as long as I keep sight of the things I like the most about streaming, I know what does and doesn't work for me. And I don't know why. I get so many people asking me to do speedruns. I... I don't know. I don't get it, to be honest. <clears throat> Maybe there's just something about this channel 
and what I do that makes people think that I should do that, but I don't like doing it. <laughs> Competition is a disease. I don't agree with that. <clears throat> Do, 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 do. People think everything needs to be scored. I mean, some people are competitive and some aren't. I'm not. I'm very not. Ads will be kicking in here shortly. So if you don't have a sub, you will see up to three minutes of ads. But I'm going to keep the game right here so you don't miss any of that. They're fun to watch, but are they fun to stream to play? Only for specific individuals, right? There's a lot of people that just thrive on that. And that's impressive. You know, they found what works for them. <clears throat> we can't interrupt gameplay to chat and go off on entertaining tangents right cat treats would be gone like i just my focus would be constantly on the game and my brain would not be able to come up with anything else i would be a very boring speedrunner to watch you were kidding oh 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 Oh, that's why. You didn't use any emotes, so I very much took you at face value. <laughs> it just, to me, looked like a legitimate question. Sorry. Do, 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 do. My bad. It's fine to compete if you want, but there are way too many people that can't appreciate anything if it's not being ranked. I guess that just depends on the kind of circles you find yourself in, you know? Because I don't encounter that very much. That mentality. I think it just really depends. But I, I agree with you that I think too many people take it too far. Like, competition is good. Okay, sorry. I think I didn't push my mute enough. Imagine if Twitch had a, a legitimate competitor right now. Both sides would be forced to innovate and make right choices <laughs> that'd be pretty swell <clears throat> that'd be pretty cool as it stands they don't have one so you like playing or showing challenge runs but games that you love or enjoy speed runs are just dreadfully stressful yeah it's not for everyone right <clears throat> it's a misunderstanding with speed running only one person can have the world record at a time yeah, that's the thing. Most speedrunners I see what that exact mentality Shrum is saying. They're racing against themselves, not anyone else. Almost every speedrunner I watch has that mentality. Like, sure, yeah, they'd like the record, but they're almost always competing against their own PV, right? Not anything else. Scone, wow. Is that one of those homegrown, organic, non-GMO subs? I think it is. <laughs> wow. Yo, thank you so much. Enjoy your emotes and the ad free experience. Do, 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 do. Rob, how's it going? Wait, scuff setup. The last I heard from you, you had a roommate drop out. What the fuck happened? <clears throat> dun, 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 dun. I think there are a lot of people that in the speedrunning community don't see it as self-improvement, but by and large, the vast majority I encounter do. Race against themselves and not really anyone else. <clears throat> so, again, I think it just depends on what you are experiencing. Because a lot of channels I watch to this day are speedrunners. And they almost all have that vibe. I want to get a PB, you know? I want to beat my score, or... Time, I should say. Alright, looks like ads are done. Thanks for waiting, everybody. Mm -hmm. You thought Mega Man 3 was one of the boxes you brought with you, but you don't see it. Oh, man. Oh, you got Minish. Nice. You don't mind people who like to race, and for a lot of games, you think it's cool, but you think a lot of great games don't lend themselves well to that approach. Right, that's why very frequently in speedrunning, you see games that are terrible games, but great speedrunning games, and vice versa. Like, awesome games that are shit for speedruns. So that's one thing I appreciate about speedrunning, is you often get a look at something people basically are never going to play otherwise. 
<clears throat> oh, fair enough, Rob. Okay. Dennis. Yo, Michael. How's it going, man? RBF? What does that mean? Gotcha, Rob. Understood. Yeah, this is a bop, isn't it? Watching bad games be... Yeah, Ren. Yeah. Yeah, those are fun. The most pure expression of joy and happiness he's seen on Twitch today was when Arcus met his personal goal in his Zelda 1 run. Spent months, six days, and a week grinding to get themselves better. Oh, that's awesome. I wish I could have seen that. I've seen something similar to that. Um, I think this was like maybe a year ago, not quite. But Coco Confession was grinding Link to the Past 100% speedruns. Like every stream for weeks and months. Like just relentless. And she finally got a PB and her reaction was incredible. <laughs> she was like crying. Like she was like crying out of joy. It was such a great moment. Because she worked so hard to finally get that. So yeah, that was really nice. I've seen things like that. Yeah, what is RBF? Resting bitch fan. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Drinking your morning coffee. Nice. <clears throat> Nobody talks about RTF. I don't know what that is either. Yeah, no, just take Rob. Listen. S stop. Stop fucking explaining yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I already went over this tonight. I'm not entitled to anyone's time. Don't make excuses. I'm not owed anything. <laughs> if you don't take care of yourself first, then I'm probably going to remove you as a mod. Because it means that you're not doing anything that's healthy right now. So fucking take care of yourself. <laughs> I don't need that shit on my conscience, and you don't either. Oh, I jumped the wrong way. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, man, that was good. I thought I could hook it. Go, 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 go. Look, you can stop it temporarily. It's a good jump, right? I got some nice air time on that one. <laughs> See, you can kind of freeze it. It's cool. Yeah, right on, Rob. Meow. Ooh, a star. Oh, my stars. Ooh, a double star. And some PS1 ASMR from Shrem. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a literal bowling bowling ball, yeah. <clears throat> Thank you for a hundred bits from Yo Hampy, what's good? I like this game, it's pretty good. I have a good time with it. It's also <sighs> Let's just say it does shit that's ridiculous. <laughs> That's the nicest way to put it. <sighs> like, blind jumps that kill you if you go in the wrong spot kind of thing. Like, secrets with no conveyance. It's that kind of game, you know? or ducks or whatever. Oh, God, I almost take... took damage. I don't like that I only have four hearts, all right? That's not cool. I don't improve with that. Mm -hmm. 
What's up there? I don't know. Chupon's leaving. All right, everybody, you can start the party now. Where, where, where'd you hide the booze? Ugh. I didn't need to take that damage. Ooh, I thought he was going to hit me. Okay. <sighs> yep. Secret hidden ghost right there. That's some BS. <laughs> Some straight BS right there. I think I died in this room. I think this is as far as I've gotten. <clears throat> All right. Oh, God dang it. <laughs> oh, we get the sound now. All right, go. This is new. Oh, what the fuck? Can they go here? Oh, no, they can't. <laughs> that was mean. Why can they go on those tiles? Oh, I thought they were safe. <sighs> okay, let's go. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Oh. Did you see that? Did you... I'm not amused, video game. <laughs> this one doesn't pause. <sighs> Reaching the turn off game. No, it's over there on the console rack. I don't rage quit games. <laughs> Oh man, this thing turns around on you. Oh. oh. It is time perfectly for you to die. That's pretty impressive how devious it is. Go, go. All right. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Breathe. Okay. I don't want to go that way. I feel like it's a trap. <laughs> Just say it. You rage ejected killer instinct once. I mean, I did. I think I rage quit a few games as a kid. I remember I once on stream got annoyed with the final boss of Demon Souls like seven years ago, and then I just stopped playing. But I don't know if that's a rage quit. I, w I think it was just like, I'm done with this bullshit, and I stopped playing. <laughs> that was a long time ago, though. The game was made expressly to appeal to Western audiences, which then begs the question, did they ever meet anyone in the West? Yeah, I... No. <laughs> cart was curved wait why was your killer instinct cart curved wait where do you live because it's the same like this is the same as any other snes cart it's not curved right it's just a different color do -do 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 -do. Do the same as Sekiro, no rage, just quit. Yeah, I didn't like that game. I didn't like, I quit because I was bored with it, honestly.
the bottom part was solid on a lot of other ones. I <laughs> have the good ending of Demon Souls. I mean, I eventually did go back and beat it. Make a little space. Doo -doo 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 -doo. You're on the final boss. You didn't care anymore. Wild. I mean, yeah, that's what happened to me with Demon Souls, right? Same. I was just like, because it was like he did an attack that literally, like, I don't know if any of you have played a Dark Souls game and how hard it is to level up, right? Because when you die, you lose all of your souls and you need those to level up. Like, you lose them all, right? And like the last boss, I won't say what he is, but I will say this about him, and it was like the final straw for me. He does an attack that de-levels you permanently. <laughs> Which is to this day, probably the biggest bullshit move I've ever seen in a video game. <clears throat> if he hits you, you go down a level permanently. <laughs> Like, to me, I was like, I couldn't believe they would ever put something like that in a game. <laughs> oh my god, is that Tin? One of the greatest CV4 speedrunners of all time. Butts Raid, I like it, Spriven. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Yo, Rayo, welcome on in. Welcome on in. What happens? He, if he hits you with that specific move in Demon Souls, you go down a level permanently. As if you never got it. <clears throat> There's a reason they axed it from future titles. Correct. Hi, Tin. You gotta go hungry for ki hurry for kindergarten. Got it. Thank you so much for the raid. Thank you. I hope you had a good time. Thanks for thinking of me. Ghouly Gamer. Yo, what up? Welcome on in. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, I don't think they do that anymore, Tristan. Yeah. <clears throat> I remember that, too. But in those games, you could cast a spell to get it back. And in Demon's Souls, it's just gone. You just have to level again. <laughs> wow. That got me to quit. No lie. That got me to quit the game. Oh, God. I thought I bent this. It's just these are flexible. Nice. Wow, these are nice. <clears throat> I thought I broke it. They're just flexible. Welcome everybody from Tin's channel. Tinu. Dude, dude, I've been following her for a couple of years now. I don't get to watch her as much as I'd like. Cause she got the baby now, right? She got the little baby. The kid. The kiddo. Do 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 do. But I have always enjoyed her corner. And if you want to know anything about me, my prime directive here is the community and the conversation. And the games are our backdrop here. They're our icebreaker, right? Style of games you'll see, retro, indie, RPG. So, I hope you get comfy. And follows are anonymous, so if you lurk like I do, you don't gotta worry about being called out. Your name will never show up unless you talk in chat. <clears throat> well, mini tin, I like that. I like that. Mini tin. Okay, this is interesting. But also, huh? <laughs> Interesting, but huh? Ooh, there's a little gap right here. Look at this. Okay. Okay. Yeah, thanks for the follow. Enjoy your lurk. Join us in chat if you'd like. Bam. I did something! I don't know what it is, but I did it! <laughs> I'm not sure. Whoa, it is, oh, it's cutscene mode. Okay. <clears throat> huh. Sweet Land of Liberty? What is this? What is this song? I just song to choose. This song is so familiar to me. Yo, rather dashing. Welcome back. Yo, happy Friday to you. The, the boat sank. 
Oh, wait a minute. I've done it. I didn't want to sink the boat. I wanted to sail it. Well, this is our life now. <laughs> Why didn't I do that, Don? Oh, man. Okay. That's God Save the Queen. Oh, because I think that ship was like a British ship or something then. Maybe. Yo, progress. Major progress. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Saving your data. Reunion. Subsea searching for Dr. Jones' location. Well, Navcom, catch a signal in time. Oh, frick. I forgot what those numbers were. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell were those numbers? Maybe he does it automatically since we already entered them. All right, so we have a kind of reef here of some kind. Maybe an ice sheet. Oh, here we go. Oh, I can't. Oh, that's right. You need a dock to actually disembark. Do, 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 do. Ah! That was unexpected. There's nothing there that conveys I can do that. Fair enough. <clears throat> we release the water and the boats. Oh, there's the conveyance. There actually is something there. It's just intermittent. <clears throat> okay. So that's probably the only place we can go, but I'm going to go to the left side and see if there's anything over there. To get the code, you have to pee on the instruction manual. That'd probably work, because you will actually have to submerge a part of it in water. <laughs> so yes, that would probably act accurately work, unfortunately. That's why you hated renting this game, because it didn't have that in there. <clears throat> Second Def Jam game. I am surprised there was more than one. Okay, this is like an infinite loop. Let's go back. Yeah, see how quickly I got back. It's interesting that it has like those infinite scroll loops. All right, let's go to the other side. Boom. All right, so we have a little little hut there of some kind. Dun, 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 dun. Some tiny islands I can't do anything with. There's some kind of secret there. Oh man. All right, let me just go to that hut. There seems to be a lot to see here. The only... Oh, yeah, I saw that. I don't think I ever broke any of my games deliberately. But there is one game I specifically remember only one time in my whole life that made me angry enough to throw a controller. <clears throat> I was in high school. Um... I'm the eldest one of all the islands. 199 years, but y'all get hard. Look for a big heart and an aisle around here. Okay. It was a football game. Like, when I was in high school, I liked football. I don't anymore. Not because of that game. I just, I don't, it's boring. I think it's boring. But anyway. <laughs> it was some Madden game on the N64. I don't remember which one. And I was super into football and pretty knowledgeable at the time. And so I was trying to set it up in a way to be as realistic as possible to like real, I guess, stats, you know, or football games. So if I played it on the medium difficulty setting, I'd win every game by like dozens of points and rush like hundreds of yards a game. It was stupid. If I put it on the hardest setting, I could basically barely win and get stuffed every time I ran the ball with the best people in the world, right? Like, there was no in, there was no realism or in-between. I think it was Madden 99, yeah. It was 64 or 99, I don't remember which. So one day I was at home from school, giving it another go, trying to just have that, like, you know, fun, competitive aspect of it. And I just was, like, using, like, Barry Sanders or someone who was, like, one of the best ever at running the ball. Name pose poem. What the fuck? Are you a game master? No. I mean, yes. So anyway, I was like constantly fumbling the ball and like losing yards and not gaining any. I got so mad I threw my N64 controller at the wall. 
And the middle, you know, like the N64 controller has like the three prongs. The middle one slammed like point first right into the wall and just bounced off. I was like, first I was like shocked because I didn't realize, I couldn't believe I did that. <clears throat> and then I was really scared and like sad because I thought I may have broken my controller. Picked it up. No pieces of plastic broke off of it. <laughs> nothing, nothing was loose. I didn't, I, it was, it looked as if it had never been thrown. But one thing I noticed was that the Z button was no longer clicking. It was really stiff and mushy. And I was like, oh no, I broke it. So I started playing a different game. And, and if this isn't proof that luck is my superpower, I don't know what is. But the result was that the Z button then suddenly became way more responsive than it was, and I could mash it better than I ever could before. <laughs> <laughs> so my one rage quit of a video game actually benefited me on an accident. <laughs> I still have that controller, and when I streamed N64, before I got the Brawler 64, I still used that. <laughs> Yeah, it was suddenly like really easy to mash because it was like mushy but very responsive. So I barely had to touch it. Yo, what's up, Penny? How's it going? There's another awesome streamer to follow. You're studying the Diablo wiki, trying to understand half a thing. Oh, or I'm assuming you're going to be playing the, the new release there. <laughs> Dr. PJ, I'm sailing your boat, searching for what? You know? Wow, that guy's a little unhinged. He's a little unhinged, you know? Yeah, it's a penny meow and she dope as hell. I unlocked secret turbo, yeah. So that's the only time I ever throw a controller and despite the result being accidentally beneficial, it scared me enough, I've never done it again. I just, I, you know, like I, oh, hello. Signal detected, North 49, East 28. Oh, he's nearby. Okay, so let's go south, not north, because memes. <laughs> Penny, are you streaming tonight? <clears throat> they got you in with a sponsorship. A Diablo 4 sponsorship? Nice. They probably didn't invite me, because I've said many times that I refuse to play any of their games ever again on stream. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you know. I did a sponsorship last weekend. That was fun. A lot of people were here for that. Two hour block of Prison City. It's really dope retro indie. There was like Shatterhand Power Blade on the NES. It was pretty good. I hope the, uh, maybe we'll get to do something again with them when it comes out. I don't know. I'm not sure what they're gonna do with that. You used to watch your uncle playing D2 when he was supposed to babysit you, if that counts. I, that's the, that game's the reason I almost failed out of my first year of college. Uh, it was like 18, I think. <sighs> Imagine a sheltered kid that basically never got to go out in his childhood for like from the age of like 10 to 18 because of a freaking psychopath grandma. And then you're on your own. You, I was living on my own, fully responsible for everything. Like going from that to that. Diablo 2 addiction almost failed out. <laughs> That was the result. I turn it around though. <laughs> I do I do pretty well when the pressure's up. Yeah, it was good, right, Rom? Yeah. Yeah, I've heard Diablo 4 looks like it's gonna be good, but I'm not gonna play it personally. But I hope the people that do have fun with it. <clears throat> Your professor's like, stay a while and listen. And you have a different idea. Yeah, I stayed a little too long, didn't I? Just not in the right places they wanted me to. Oh man, that sucks, Andrew. All right, let's see if we can't get in there. There's a little like that. Those usually are something you can travel underwater for. Spray of Island Grishin. Yeah, okay, why not? I hadn't tried that yet. <clears throat> Blue. Do, 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 do. Where does this go? Dead end? Probably. 
Yep. Yuppers. The dentist of ends. Alright, let's go down here. Doo -doo -doo. Your uncle is 33. D2 is the reason of his unemployment. Oh, wow. Relatable. <laughs> I can, I think I can safely say, I got a big apple, okay. Nothing happens. I can safely say I don't think I've ever had any job consequences from video games. <clears throat> so, there's that at least. Unless you count this, and then everything I do as a consequence to the job, good or bad. <laughs> You know, technically. <clears throat> Let's see, when Diablo and 2 came out, yeah, you would have been like... I don't know, teenager, Penny? No, not even that old. You're like... You've told me how old you are. I don't remember. But if I had to guess, you're like 28. <clears throat> so you would have been like 8. Or maybe younger, because that came out in 2000, 23 years ago. You've probably been younger than that. You were eight. Oh, okay. There you go. Wait, if you were eight. Okay. Right on. Dude, you're going to be 31 later this year. Okay. That's right. I remember you had a whole discussion about how you're not afraid to tell people how old you are. I never really understood that. I, you know, like... People that are afraid to talk about how old they are. I guess everybody has the reasons, though. You know? Like, on the general internet, I can see why. You know, people don't want to give their information to anybody. Like, that makes sense to me. Like, in person? Like, even people I know, like, in family have been like that. And I'm just like, what the fuck difference does it make? <laughs> like... <clears throat> got a big heart it's there thanks for noticing yeah now nah, you can't change it might as well not lie about it i like that attitude you gotta check this new island you go to and it looks like i already did the part that probably didn't help your fear of the ocean which part which part shaku <clears throat> took you five years to admit how old you were on twitch was that like a sword point for you, Shrum? Because like, I like to understand that point of view because I've never shared it, right? Or was it just like kind of a meme for you and your community to try and like have people guess? <clears throat> yeah, what's up, Loch Ness? How are you? Make that dialogue box a, a tip alert? That's not a bad idea. Put it in the suggestion box. It was a sore point. It still kind of is. Okay. Fair enough. <clears throat> now, I'm curious as to the why, but I don't want you to discuss it if it makes you uncomfortable. So, I, you know, don't, don't, don't feel, don't feel like you have to, or that I'm trying to force you to. Roger, Roger. <laughs> Those little robot guys from Star Wars? Oh man. Oh, this is just kind of an empty island, isn't it? This is a nice game though, isn't it? I think I would have loved this game as a kid. The 40 plus singer, single gamer dude is not the favorite demographic. That's fair, yeah. I definitely kind of get that vibe. Cause I do feel like I'm frequently discounted because of that. <clears throat> So, it is what it is, I guess. I could retire there and make a little hut? Yeah. The only scary thing to you, Penny, is some people on Twitch might say, you, Grandma, and not watch. Yeah, I think that's what kind of what me and Shrum are getting at. Play but <clears throat> the thing about that is, do you want people in your community who have that mentality? Because I sure fucking don't. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like a it's like a self filter, you know. It just takes care of itself. <clears throat> I had a friend on Twitch who, well, I, I'd still consider them a friend, but I'm 
not comfortable with them anymore. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. But I used to talk to them. And they told me that they didn't want guys on their channel because they were afraid of what their viewers would think. And I told them, if those are the kind of people you want on your channel and want around you, like, no wonder you're struggling. <laughs> they at least understood what I was saying to them, though. So I'm pretty sure they learned from it. But it was like... Like, to, the things that we could view as a weakness, you know, or a detriment, like, I see as... as a strength. Like, it's less work that I have to do to get rid of annoying people. Right? So, I don't know. But then on the other side of that is... to Penny's credit. I'm not a woman on the internet that's attractive, so I don't get that kind of attention that she probably gets literally every fucking day, right? So, <laughs> it's there's a, there's a big difference, you know? There's a huge difference. <clears throat> Anyone says, ew, grandma isn't worth listening to. Right, yeah. <clears throat> you would watch a grandma stream on Twitch? I have. I don't know if she still does. There was this grandma who would stream Skyrim. And then, like, post these, like, really wholesome pictures of it on Twitter about her adventures in Skyrim. It was adorable. It was, like, one of the best channels. <laughs> I don't know if she does that anymore. <clears throat> but, man, that was such a great vibe. It was really cool. <clears throat> Yo, came by you. Speaking of annoying people, why are you saying that about yourself? That's not right. Do, 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 do. Orin. What's... What's an Orin? What's your little kitty? Who's a cute little kitty? Who's a nice old gal? Who's this pretty kitty? Say hi to little kitty. Alright, let's go here and say hi to the little kitty diva. You wanna say hi to everyone? Yeah? You want Pat Pats? Yeah, she likes that. You like your Pat Pats? Yeah? Okay. Skyrim Grandma. Yeah, I forgot her name. Really cool. I haven't seen her stuff in a long time. <clears throat> oh, you want to lay down? Okay, but you can't lay on my stream deck. There you go. <clears throat> there you go, little kitty. All right, we have a loaf. We have a cat loaf. Would anyone like to see a cat loaf? Are you feeling the cat loaf vibes right now? At some point, being super old on Twitch is a benefit. Right. <clears throat> you made a joke about Margaret Thatcher and somebody said, Who's that? So yeah, you don't want kids around. <laughs> uh, what up, Agony? Answering the question of the night. What you got? Favorite games to watch? Any game that doesn't require your attention. Ooh. If you can hear the streamer narrate and follow along, it's the perfect game for you. I like that. That gives me more incentive to better narrate. I hope I do an okay job at it. All right, let's say hi to the loaf here. Hello, little loaf. Are you stealing my desk? Look at these white spots. You see those? Those are from her clawing and making bread on the mouse pad. I need a new one. This was the one Twitch sent me like two years ago, and it's just fucked from the cats. Yep, there's the little diva. This is her desk now. Point of view. All right, here's my POV. This is what I see. So you see? See her head? This is why I have to move the chat window up whenever they're on the desk, because it's always down here. Oh, look, cat. So I got to move this shit out of the way. <laughs> Damn you, kitty. Here, look at her face. You got the spot right there. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Oh, you getting excited? Okay. You get excited? Yeah? She got a little excited. What you doing? Dun, 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 dun. You have a lady in her 70s who's streaming in Swedish. She's always on the Swedish front page. Oh, that's great. That's really cool. Hello, Grandma on Twitch who plays games with her granddaughters. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> that's so cool. You went back to school 2013 to 18 and during one class, a professor was explaining a computer science concept. So you leaned over to the kid next to you and he said, yeah, that's basically Y2K. And he looked at you and said, what's that? And then you left. 
Oh, Shrum. Oh, man. Love it. Fucking love it, dude. Oh, what a vibe. Trick question, always cat loaf. That's true. Yeah. If I didn't do a good job of it, you wouldn't be here. Oh, right on. Thanks. Hell yeah. Your follow list is small. You are very picky. That's that's really... That's big. That's big praise. You know? She's needing my love. Oh, my goodness. Loch Ness. How dare you? Hello, Curly. Oh, my goodness. Curly's in my channel. Curly, I'm sure you get this a lot, but I like your curly hair. And I really strongly wonder where your Twitch name came from. I have no, no idea. No. <laughs> How's it going? How's it going? I, I like hanging out on your channel, okay? I like it. It's, 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 it's very, what's, what's the word for it? I don't know. There's this kind of energy there that I just don't really see anywhere else. <clears throat> yeah, go follow Curly. Penny, Penny, you know Curly? Dope. Penny knows Curly. Curly, where did I meet you? Was it Bear Boost channel or was it like, maybe it was like Luna Moth Wings? Could have been Penny too. I don't remember. I don't remember. I have ADHD, everyone, so my memory is the equivalent of root vegetable. So I forget things that I said minus three seconds ago. So, you know, it was bear boo. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Or as I call her boo boo bear boo butt. That's when she talks in chat, it literally says boo boo bear boo butt. And then when I talk in her chat, it says phenomena, 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 phenomena. It like literally takes up the whole screen. It's ridiculous. <laughs> also, I don't know why I'm walking in circles, but this here we are. Rob Crusoe Cola. Okay. Hello, Crusoe. Rob Crusoe Cola. I don't know what that means. <clears throat> Do, 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 do. That's fine, Lokness. You you go right ahead. You go right ahead. Oh, that sucks, Andrew. It's good to hear she made a recovery though. Do, 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 do. Luna? Yeah, Luna Mothwings. I met Luna Mothwings like five or six years ago in uh, a mutual friend of ours channel. Her name's um, what is her? What does she go by now on Twitch? Her name's Kirsty. But what's her Twitch name? It's like Tiny Shark or something. Tiny Shark Plays. Yeah. She used to run a different channel called, like, Average Jotaku. Um, and I raided her once because I was playing Knights of the Old Republic, and so was she. I needed a raid target, and she was on her Jotaku channel. Um, and the title literally said, Test Stream Don't Watch. So obviously I raided her channel, right? Because as soon as I saw that, I'm like, no fucking way. We're going here. <laughs> and Luna Mothwings was a part of her community way back then. And that's how I met Luna. So, yeah. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Luna has one of the nicest sounding voices on Twitch, IMO. And she always tries to downplay it. I don't think she understands. <laughs> that woman needs to do voice acting because, dang. She sent you the screenshots of what she calls me in Coco. <laughs> oh no. <clears throat> oh man. She's she's got a pattern going, huh? <clears throat> Put it back! Okay, Don. I'll leave it there for you, okay? Do 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 boop, boop, boop. You want Luna to become the most successful human ever? She's pretty dope, yeah. She has such a good like vibe I, I i i told her like oh i like your channel one day i was like lurking i'm like i always like this is like how i like to start my day because sometimes she's live when i wake up um you know it's always so relaxing and she was surprised because she she considers herself always teetering on the edge of like barely restrained i think she called herself the vibe she called herself was barely restrained seething <laughs> it's like i guess i don't know it's relaxing here i don't know what to tell you <clears throat> Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. As is tradition, of course, of course, of course. Do, 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 do. Dying is someone you had a conversation about raids during test streams. I love it. You have to, right? Test stream, don't watch. Everyone's going to show up. I should just make that my title tomorrow. 
There'll be like 200 people. <laughs> uh, do, 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 do. You're going to be out of your comfort zone. Oh, you'll be fine, Penny. Diablo games, point and click. Click shit, level up, put some stats, maybe pick a skill. They're pretty basic. They're usually quick to learn, tough to master kind of games. So, you'll be alright. Delve, what kind of games do you like watching? Zelda speedruns, random retro games you've never seen. You love... 8 and 16-bit aesthetics. Gotcha. They feel like hanging out in a arcade. Oh, right on. Hell yeah. I don't know where to go. Oh, maybe that way. <laughs> maybe that way. Oh, this is different. Okay. <clears throat> Man, it's hot in here. I feel like this summer is going to kick my ass. My AC has been on like full blast all day. and But when I'm streaming, it's like 80s in this corner. Which, what is that in Celsius? Like 20 something? I don't know. <clears throat> Close to 30? Yeah, Penny's got like a like a sponsor thing. Penny, when is your sponsor thing? Is it today? Does that mean I can raid you? <laughs> How do I see in the glasses? Um I have to think about that. I just do? Wait. <laughs> Wait, wait, like, wait, how do I answer that? Hold on, let's see if this works. <laughs> <laughs> like that? Although it's not as red when I look at it. It's just the angle of the lens. It doesn't look like that, like color-wise. It was definitely thrown off. It's just darker. <clears throat> There's a lot of lights in here. Um, and I wear these because I get ocular migraines. And I have been for years wearing them on stream. So really the the biggest detriment is since they're blue blocking things, if they're, I mean a game, especially N64, where that's really dark or and or blue, it just looks like impossibly dark to me and I have to just do this. So yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know why it looks red on that lens because it doesn't do that. Like when I have it right here doesn't really change the colors that much at all if it is my eyes have gotten used to it and have adjusted but yeah like i have five monitors on right now so like you can see how bright this is if like i do pov here then let's go droid cam so pov right main monitor there's Music, bits, tip tracker, tertiary monitor. I use that when I'm using this for gaming. There's OBS, right? There's our Inception. Woo! <laughs> right? Here's vertical monitor, dashboard, chat, alerts, whatever. CRT for retro gaming. Okay. Two PCs under there. So that's more heat. Consoles all here. That's more heat, lights, light panel. I think I actually came by you there, bought that for me. I think it was, no. Came by you bought me something else. I can't remember what it, oh, what it was. More lights, so ring light. It gets hot, really freaking hot. There's a lot of lights, it's very bright. So, it's not hard to see, I promise. But my lens is so good, I've actually demoed this to people I can turn literally every light off except that ring light and you'll all still be able to see me without any issues. Clearly, like crystal clear. And I may have to do that on hot days. <clears throat> Am I trying to make you self-promote? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, do that. <laughs> do that. Hmm, what is this? <clears throat> oh. Oh. oh! 
oh, 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 oh. Does that keep going, by the way? Doesn't look like it. <clears throat> What's the advantage of two PCs? Uh, I, all the horsepower for the encoding for the live stream is separate from anything else happening on the other machine, right? So games, programs, downloads, pretty much anything won't affect the live stream encode. So all resources on that system could be dedicated to just OBS and potentially like bots and things on that system. It's, I don't think it's as necessary these days as it used to be because the encoding chips that are now built directly into GPUs, specifically NVIDIA, to a degree now AMD as well, are really good <clears throat> and separate from the actual GPU usage during games. Um, <clears throat> but I do CPU encoding anyway. Although technically I do both on that system. CPU encoding for the live stream, GPU encoding for recordings. <clears throat> simultaneously so all of that horsepower in that system is dedicated to recording and live streaming and basically nothing else so I can push it as hard as I need to you don't know which classes are good they all are if it's built like any Diablo penny they're all good you don't have to worry about what's good you, you should pick what looks cool if they're if it's built like anything like other Diablos just pick what looks cool it'll be it should be balanced do, 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 do. Five monitors, yeah. Nine monitors and a TV. Good lord. Why do you have? What do you have? What's your wait? What's your use case for that much at once? I'm curious. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Yeah, at least eight F difference agony. It's because there's like not much airflow in this corner, so. I have really good airflow in my two PCs, but <laughs> not in this specific corner. It's going to be today unless you die of anxiety. Oh my goodness. Ma'am, you're going to be fine. You're going to be fine. Just enjoy it like you always do. It's more necessary if you're playing modern games. Even still... If you have like a 2000 series or higher GPU, it doesn't really matter too much. Because again, the encoding on the GPU is done on a separate chip that's dedicated to that. It doesn't affect the resources of the rest of the GPU. <clears throat> Which is how I'm able to GPU encode on here at the same time as I am doing other stuff. Apex at 2K plus pushing 1080p at 6K takes a lot of work. Right, yeah. Yes, Delph, exactly. Yeah. And that's all in part due to the GPU and uh, dedicated video encoding chips that they have now. How does that work? You play a game on one, send the image to the other, and that one streams it? Yeah. So, you know what a capture card is, right? So, for, for someone who wants to play Super uh, Switch on Twitch, right? They have to put that into a capture card, right? So that the PC can receive that video signal. Okay? Well, just think of the main gaming machine as just another console. It too has to send the video signal to a capture card on the other system. So you just treat it like it's a console almost. <clears throat> there are other ways to route that signal, but that's the basic concept. You use the monitors for work. Ah, okay. Remotely working on oil field. Oh, okay. That makes a lot of sense. That sounds kind of like my old job. I had, there was like 12 to 14 monitors. Half of them are 4K. And each one had many camera feeds on them. So yeah, I get it. <clears throat> Compositing still takes up GPU resources. Correct. Correct. But compositing does not take a lot of GPU resources unless you're doing what I'm doing, which is ridiculous amounts of like 3D filters and spammy alerts. Like something like this, right? Like if somebody spams, I don't know, this like five times. <laughs> right? Somebody spams that like five times. That takes a lot of compositing, because, what, 
WebMs or whatever, there's no such thing as like GPU hardware encoding for that or whatever. So, where am I going? I don't know. I think that's how I got in here. What was down here? Dead end? Dead end? No. This. What is this? Hi. What this? This is a maze. I'm lost! What? Did I go back to where I was? I did. Okay. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Do do the TVs for the Xbox and sports during football season. Do you know what you love? Super duper high quality my camera. Oh. Are you gonna do something like that too? It wasn't cheap. Yo, dashing. Thanks for hanging out with us. It's good to have you. I'm vibing the music. They're in a bad spot. My understanding is it really shouldn't matter what you pick in that game. Honestly, I feel like with games like Diablo and ARPGs, the people that talk about what is and isn't balanced are the people that are only thinking about end game and like min max grinding. And they're not thinking about just the general player experience going from start to finish. And when it comes to that in almost every game like that, it does not matter what you pick. Just pick what's fun or looks cool. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. What's this? Dead end? Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. What a maze this is. Jesus. Okay. Yeah, man. Do, 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 do. Blizzard's making D4 live service. I mean, so was D2 and D3, and to a degree, D1. So that's not anything abnormal. Your knowledge of cameras is limited to you click a button and take a photo. All right. Well, if it's something you're interested in, just DM me. But it's not cheap. So. I do have this camera I haven't tested yet until I set up my new PC. But look into this one. You need a USB 3.0 spot port for it, but this thing's got a nice lens. It's not going to look as good as my camera, but it'll come pretty close, but it's also really expensive, but not as expensive as my camera and lens. Because for a camera and lens like I have, you need a camera, you need a lens, and you need a capture card. My system has two capture cards in it. Do, 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 do. You can do any content on any class. The world can be dynamically scaled. Ooh, that's really good. There you go. So it sounds like you can't just pick whatever looks cool. $9.99 per DM. Yikes. No, thank you. <laughs> Yeah, so this new alert system that I have uses WebM video files. There is no such thing as hardware decoding for WebM video files. So it's all pushed to the CPU. But this bot lets you stack alerts. So 133 bits, 154, 182, 432, like all at the same time, right? Why the hell am I in such a rush? When that happens, it hammers the CPU and you get stutters and or delay. So to kind of look to the future, the system I'm running on is old, years old. It's getting long in the tooth because I'm pushing the encoding and compositing to their limit. And that bot has really just, you know, the, been the tipping point. Also, I'm lost, really fucking lost. <laughs> So I got new parts a couple months ago and then kept running into issues. And my struggle with ADHD meds has made it exceedingly hard for me to do anything outside of stream. Like the executive dysfunction and the struggle with these medicines and lack of success has been really demoralizing. So I haven't built the system yet. 
it also there was like two major issues that happened with recent PC hardware that gave me pause. So I'm waiting for BIOS updates to finally pull the trigger on building that setup. Twelve hundred dollars. <clears throat> Buy the camera and the lens used, like I did. The camera and the lens used combined was just under six hundred, and then I had a spare capture card that takes HDMI. But you can get a half decent one as long as you don't get some shitty like Amazon one that's like twenty bucks. You can get a half decent one for easily under a hundred, and then your cost is about half what was quoted to you. Looks like in 30 seconds, ads will kick in here. So if you're not subbed, consider subscribing. You know, it'll turn off ads, but more importantly, it'll give you great emotes and help support me. Um, but I pause gameplay during ad rolls so you don't miss any. <clears throat> so maybe get some water, stretch, or I don't know, stick around because I'm going to keep talking. <laughs> it can't use anything other than WebMs? Oh, it absolutely can. But WebMs have transparency. <clears throat> right? That's kind of the key there. So it can use MP4. Um, what else? I think it can use other stuff too, but WebMs have transparency. You're going to tell that to people writing you DMs. Oh yeah. You said you were going to update me on some weird situation like that. I don't remember what it was. I can't remember what you said. You don't have to, though. I just just remembered you said that. Canon cameras don't need capture cards. Yes, that's true. But aren't most of them limited to USB 2? Which kind of diminishes the visual quality. I feel like they'd be fine if they were USB 3, though. Because <clears throat> when you, 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 you're forced to use USB 2, it usually has to decode it to like MPEG or MJPEG or whatever it's called. And then it doesn't look as good. Yeah. Well, the thing is, Michael, it's never... I just got diagnosed officially in February. I was self-diagnosed for three years, maybe two. And I've been spending the better part of this year testing medicine for it. And nothing has worked. At all. So, I don't know. I'm kind of demoralized on that whole scenario. <clears throat> it's been really tough. Just dealing with that. Do 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 Agony. I have some advice. <laughs> Penny is nervous about this sponsored stream. So can you tell her things that don't make it worse? <laughs> good things about it to ease her transition and not you know pile on <laughs> uh yeah firebot don yeah if you can still hear me it's really fun past few days i've been super busy and messy okay got it <clears throat> got it mental health isn't well understood yeah we're on our sixth medicine right now it's a stimulant, and all the stimulants I've taken have not done anything. And I just don't understand how that's even possible. Like, how do they not do anything? I don't feel like I get any energy for it. It doesn't help me wake up or start my day better. It doesn't help me focus, right? It doesn't help my executive dysfunction. Like, it doesn't help my distractibility. I don't understand how it's possible that it's literally doing none of that. <clears throat> oh, wow, Penny, wild. No, it's all right. I can <laughs> yeah, no, it's all good. I'm just like, I'm, you know, I'm trying to put myself in her shoes. She said she's really nervous. So I'm like, okay, <laughs> let's be mindful of that. You can use smartphones cam. Oh, she has a camera. Penny's a partner streamer. She's been around a block. She knows what she's doing. She just wants to upgrade. And I don't think a smartphone is going to be an upgrade over what she's using right now. Do anything to help relax. It's a lot. Yeah. Yeah. She's got a lot going on right now. <clears throat> Serotonin blockers. I don't know what that means. 
I'm assuming some of the non-stimulants I took previously were that, but I don't really know. How long have I been streaming? Too long. <laughs> I was literally talking earlier today about how I have to learn how to stream. Because I've been trying to do things this year that have just not been working. <clears throat> and I feel like I've become my worst nightmare, which is just a dude who streams games and doesn't offer much else. Um, I've been streaming for seven years as of February, so over seven years. I don't... I, I feel bad, but I have seen a lot of streamers that I looked up to back then, and just people that were in the same position as me back then, who are just gone. Or they were people who were hitting numbers like I do, or well beyond, who have a fraction of that now, and they just look miserable. And I don't ever want to be in their shoes. And right now I feel like I'm on that precipice. And then I need to fucking do something about it. <clears throat> So I'm trying to think of ways to make it work. Because I want to be the kind of streamer that can play any weird retro game and not see significant viewership drops when I do. And, and I'm not there yet. So I'm still trying to figure that out. Like I need to learn how to stream. I know I've been streaming for seven years, but this isn't the same platform as it was seven years ago or six or five or four or three or two, right? And I don't think I've kept on top of that this year. <clears throat> so I'm still trying. Also, if anyone has any hints right now, I'm pretty lost and I don't know where to go. I'd like to get into a, you know, a dungeon or something here. Nice song. What about you, Curly? How long you been streaming? <clears throat> na -na 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 -na. They help you not burn all your happy juices all at once and go into a prolonged low emotional state. Reuptake inhibitors? I think I did try those. <clears throat> I did openly talk in Discord about the non-stimulants I tried once I was done with them because I refused to tell anyone what I was on at any given point because I didn't want to be biased. <clears throat> Don't give up. I'm not giving up. Well, I've also been very bluntly honest about the struggles I've been going through this year. And some people don't like that. And I've noticed more unfollows this year than I ever have gotten. So I know it's rubbing some people the wrong way. And that's fine. They'll find the place they want to be, right? <clears throat> I'm not going to change for them. Do, 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 do. Do not loose to win. What? <laughs> Realizing you have to do something is the first step in actually doing it. Yeah. It is. So, you know, here's like... Now, let's talk about a positive thing that happened recently. Because I think it's worth not noting. I stressed very importantly last week that I was having a sponsored stream on Saturday. And how important it was for people to show up. Because... Those numbers, those analytics that I talk about so much that bother people help drive what those sponsors pay us. And to everyone's credit, people showed the fuck up that night. It was awesome. Usually when I switch to like a sponsored segment, I see a big dip and I didn't. The retention was huge that night. People stuck around. Even if they didn't watch, they kept the tab open. That was big. So I was really happy to show that to the sponsor. <clears throat> you know, like I owe a lot to everyone who helped me with that. So, that's going to be a pretty decent payoff. Making time for yourself is important. Yeah, it's something I'm trying to do more of, but ADHD, I, I was saying this earlier. <clears throat> I know this isn't the full reason, but it's a big, it's a big contributor. I, it's been weeks since I've been able to functionally pick something for me to do to relax. So I'm stressed and exhausted right now. And people, when I say that, people are like, take a day off. That's been the problem. Every day off has just been me sitting here in anxiety and stress for 10 plus hours because I can't decide what to do. Like, it's just blocked. Completely blocked. And I, I, I imagine for people who are neurotypical, that sounds 
fucking ridiculous. Like, try living it. Because <laughs> it is. It's fucking ridiculous. <clears throat> the path to solving a problem is built with words about it. Yeah. You hit one year at the end of last month. That's right. That was you saying that you just kind of have ridden the wave since you started. Yeah, that was one thing I liked about your channel. You had a really healthy attitude about it. Yeah, now I remember. Now I remember you were talking about how... Yeah, because I was in your one-year celebration stream. That's what it was. Okay. Now I remember. Yeah, you were talking about... Like how just, you know, surprised but happy you were with everything that's been happening to you. And you, you're really humble about it. I like that a lot. <clears throat> Loading screen tips. Remember, licking doorknobs is illegal on other planets. Thank you. I have no idea what that means, but we should write that down. That sounds important. Also, ch chat, help me out. Where the frick do I go? <laughs> I'm so lost. Uh, maybe here. Let's look down here again. Let's go down here. Where's this go? Maybe that was it. Um, what? Maybe that was it. Did I find it? North 20, East 11. Oh, I think we're under something. I think we're under something. I bet it's up here. What? Okay. North 5, East 6. Never mind, I found it. <laughs> Every time I'm like, chat, where do I go? It's just like a, a bear. Stumble on it. Do, 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 do. Taking time off always has a negative impact. It does for me. I don't like taking time off. It stresses me out, even when I can make decisions. I hate it. <laughs> Yo, secret? That's how you say it. Yo, thanks. Right on. Thanks for saying that. That was really nice of you. You felt that? Yeah? Days off are days we spend working, just not live. Yeah. Like, I try to force myself on Mondays and Tuesdays to chill. And for, like, maybe the previous month, before the last two weeks, I was at least able to pick a game and, and relax and just veg out. Like, I was playing RimWorld on my own for a little while, and that was fine, but I got just bored, you know? Like, I just kind of got over it, and now I haven't played anything for myself in weeks <clears throat> or done anything for myself in weeks, and it's... As you can imagine, just exhausting. Okay. North three. One, two, three. The signal stopped. Dive. Yes. Look at this. Oh, secrets. Dr. J. Why are we talking about Harley Quinn? <laughs> she's not here right now. Harley Quinn Jester. She's a cool streamer. I haven't seen her in a while, though. She's like a morning person. Unless there's something you can do with APNGs. I'm stuck with Wimbam. I know. You don't need to dive into it, Don. I spent two days doing so. I get it. <laughs> Thank you. But I understand what it's capable of and what it isn't. <clears throat> Webms. CPU encoding. Better system, we'll be fine. You were curious? Yeah, now you know, right? Now you know the power of the Firebot. It's been weird to be on the platform for such a short time and succeed when you've seen other people not get their goals and be on Twitch for so much longer. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and it, and it sucks, too, because I had someone a few months ago tell me that they've been on Twitch as long as I have, streaming. And they haven't met the same success. And they were trying to just count, like, chalk that up to luck. And I know they didn't mean anything by it, but basically what they were telling me was the only reason I'm here and they're not was luck. Right? And when, when you put it like that, you know, that sounds ridiculously insulting for one, but also kind of misguided, you know? <laughs> yeah. It belittles everything I've done. And I think too many people put too much credit to luck for Twitch success. The only time I think that really comes into play is people at the very top. 
And even then, it's really not as big or as pronounced as people think it is. <laughs> there are things you can and can do and things you should avoid doing to get to where you want to on Twitch. It's just that most people aren't ready and or willing to put in that effort. <clears throat> and that's fine. Like, because I don't think people who don't want to do that should feel like they're forced to, you know? Like, they shouldn't. They should just treat it like a hobby and enjoy what they... What, the fruits of whatever it is that they're putting into it. <clears throat> I don't think Curly's lucky either. <clears throat> you know? Like, w is there some factor in luck to everyone making it on Twitch? Yes, but I don't think I've ever in one scenario ever seen it as the main factor and, and you know keep in mind i've been on twitch as a viewer and a streamer for over seven years so i i, I think it's fair to say i have some credibility when it comes to that kind of thing Doo -doo 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 -doo. i just i think people to put too much credit to luck i don't really think it's much of a factor at all Oh, this looks cool. This is like, oh, this makes me want to play Dragon Quest. <laughs> luck alone, you don't go anywhere. Yeah, I just think luck is a pretty low factor in terms of what decides success. I don't think it's ever at the top. I don't think it's even close. Close. Like, this is so cool looking. Yeah. Nice music change, too definitely makes me want to play DQ. Ooh, look at these statues. Man, this game would have really impressed me as a kid a lot. You know, like I like to do, I always look at, try, let's view the game through the lens of its time, right? This was like 89, 90. And this has a lot of like gameplay concepts and elements and visuals that you just didn't see very often. I can see why this game was liked so much. It was, I think it was ahead of its time. Like, this is pretty impressive for an NES game of 1990. Let's see what we got in here. It's kind of spooky. Whoa, it's dungeon time. That's what that means. That was just the entrance. Mm, we got a different design, too. Okay. Let's see if we got a secret. It's a secret. It's not a secret. We didn't find one. Rip. <clears throat> Whose emote is that? Oh, it's, yeah, in-game asylum. Yeah, it's a good channel. That dude, his production quality is staggering. You think mine's good? Mine is good. His is like movie industry good. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty dope. <clears throat> oh, I wanted to get that. Do, do, do. Oh, yeah, there you go. Your name. <laughs> yeah, hey, you, hey, you. What is that? I'm orange. Okay. I have my suspicions. Long jump? Oh. I'm gonna need a towel. Just saying, all right? Just putting that out there. <clears throat> wow! Sorry, I just I like things like that. You know what the most satisfying thing ever in a video game? I will hold to this. I don't care what I'm playing. The most satisfying thing ever in a video game is when you can double jump. I don't care what game it is. You let me double jump, I'm like, oh, let's fucking go! It's the greatest. <laughs> <laughs> or when it's like an unlock that you worked really hard to get, you get double jump. It's a game changer! It's, it's the, everything's different after that. Emergent gameplay, I love it. You get you get a thing and suddenly you can do two more things or however much, right? Love emergent gameplay. It's the best. You know what's one of the best games of, with emergent gameplay concept around it? Freaking Stardew Valley. That game's so good with that. 
oh, you learned how to make this recipe? Well, now you can do four more things. And the game just like does that forever. <laughs> so good. Okay, I got him. Do 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 do. Yeah, freedom. Thanks for the raid. He went into this story about how he made it all happen. His puzzles and his set design. Yeah, dude, is he is inspiring. Yeah. Freedom, thank you for the raid. How was Legend of Heroes? Ah, you are in for the long haul, aren't you? Yeah. Do 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 do. Oh my God, Don, please no, no. Boom, 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 boom. Brat, Freedom, welcome in. Uh, Delph, can we get shout outs? Oh, you were already ahead of it. Look at the moderation. He's already doing it. Thanks, Delph. Appreciate that, man. Welcome everyone in Phenomenon. I like chatty. Like I, I talk lots. I talk big word lot. I, I, I focus on the conversation and community. You, 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 you person. You, you, I do that. Okay. The games are our icebreakers, our backdrops. So enjoy, enjoy the retro games, the indie games, the RPGs, the conversation more than anything. So yeah, hell yeah. So tired. Hi Turk Dog. How you doing, man? Let's see. Who else came in? Came on in. Do 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 do. Freedom. He's been around a while, man. Working on de-rusting Crisis Core for RPG Limit Break. Are you? Do you got to run in that? I'm not. I'm not going this year. I'm maybe next year. I'm. I'm going to TwitchCon this year. I think. Pretty sure. Anyway, I got a room. So. Spanky. Hello. Welcome. 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 Let me catch up with chat here. You're an awesomely successful streamer. You adore the person, but they just play games. Not big on community activity, not big on social media, just plays games. You would say they don't put in the hard work. A lot of other streamers do, but they still attract a ton of viewers. Are you envious? Yes. Do you love them? Yes. And you wish they do even better. Um, I have a few people that on the surface look like they quote unquote just play games, and I can guarantee you that that's not what's happening. <laughs> Uh, again, it's not always as simple as it looks. A lot of times it could be a very cultivated and or exceptional personality, or there's just a lot of things and or things happening in the back end that you don't see or credit. Love that gameplay loop and a link to the past. Yeah, they're very good with the emergent gameplay. Zelda games have historically always been really good about that. Same for Metroidvanias. Stardew is a good vibe. Oh, yeah. Valheim does that too. That's true. Although when I got to the point where you had to just grind iron forever, I kind of got bored with it. But it had the it had the concept built into it. And they can only, you know, it's their foundation. So it's like a D&D game master who has some really good ideas, but punishes you brutally if you stray off the path they wanted to tell. What is? Wait, what is like that? Oh, sorry, I lost the context. You're opening the marathon with Crisis Core and you're running Digital Devil Saga 2 in the middle of the week. Dude, congrats. Two runs. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, pat yourself on the back for that. That's dope. I worked, uh stage tech for RPG Limit Break and uh, where did my double jump go or long jump that must only be for the room it's in oh rude <laughs> rude so rude <sighs> welcome to Star Tropics <laughs> Jesus oh man I'm getting racked here Am I going to Vegas? Yeah. Yeah. I got I got someone who says that I can room with them, so that was the main thing holding me back. Um, but since that seems to be pretty set in stone, I'm going. I'm also maybe going to be on a panel. I don't know yet. We'll see what happens there. I don't know, but at the least I'm, I'm going, so yeah. 
apologize for sounding negative. That's fine. I just feel like people who might look like that's all they're doing, generally speaking, it's just not true. There's more there. But some people are really good at just keeping the presentation where it is, right? And all the other stuff behind the scenes is being done just there. This game will kill you with no warning, but it's got a lot of fun and interesting stuff. Yeah, overall, I really like this. All right, so it does look like this might only last in the room that you get it in, right? Let's see if it disappears when I transition to the next room. Yeah, it's just the room you're in. Okay, now we know. Now we know, that's unfortunate. I was really hoping for that to be a permanent upgrade. That would have been pretty swell. Da -da 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 -da. Woo! It's funny because like I'm downplaying luck as a factor on Twitch significantly. Despite me saying luck's my superpower, it's not why I'm here. <laughs> it's just not. And it's not why most people are here. The vast majority of people who got quote unquote here. I ain't due to luck. I can promise you that. Do, 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 do. Luck is opportunities to use your secret sauce to extra great effect. Yeah. I think, quote unquote, luck is more often the ability to recognize opportunities and capitalize on them. And the, the fact of the matter is, there's a lot more of them than people notice. So... I think it has a lot to do with just your work ethic, what you're putting into, how smart you're working, how much you're networking. Like there's streamer friends of mine from years ago who have done just about everything that I do and more, except that they are invisible in pretty much every other channel. You never see them anywhere. And so they're not going anywhere. Oh, we got it again. We got the long jump again. Love it. Let's go. Oh, it even has a different sound. So you know. I dig it. Ooh. So do we go left top or mid? Let's go mid. Look at this. It's almost like a maze. Hmm. Did we choose the wrong way? Looks like we... Well, maybe. This might actually be a switch. No switch. Okay. I made my bed. I'm going to sleep in it. This is dead end. No, it's not. Here we go. Dang. So we still got to find the switch. So this is a, definitely a different kind of maze. It's kind of cool. Jenny, how you doing today? How's your uh, chaos randos and whatnot going? And Suikoden and all that. I saw you were streaming Suikoden too lately, but I couldn't watch because I didn't want to spoil it. Sorry. <laughs> You're volunteering for stream and stage tech? Right on, dude. I initially wanted to do audio tech, but if I ever do it again, I'm like, no. Put me on hosting, interviews, anything that I can use my voice. That's what I want to do. Do, 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 Yeah, that, that was unfortunate, Tristan. You were made to replay this recently for an hour. You kind of enjoyed the music. Play it longer. Uh, if you want, right? Like is when you get a big raid. I, I, no. <laughs> I think those aren't luck either. I think the only time those are luck is if the, the stream, the big raid came from someone who had never heard of you before and no one told them to go there. That's the only time that's luck. 99% of all my big raids have been from people who found out who I was for one way or another. Whether I became a part of their community or they saw me on some other medium, you know, whatever. Like even those, I don't think those are luck. Like I think it's a super rare to just have like a random huge raid from someone that's never heard of you. put in seven years of hard work and, and among other things yeah that's a part of it I just like I, I I think it's important for people to recognize that also I went the wrong way my bad 
just working hard isn't gonna cut it. You gotta work smart, too. Hard work alone ain't gonna do shit on Twitch. That's where that whole, like, grind mentality came from. Oh, just stream a lot and work hard all the time. You'll get there. That's not true. Oh, this was a kill all monsters room. Okay. Now I got this. Okay. There wasn't even a switch. We just gotta kill everything. Let's go here. See what this does. Okay. Boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 boom. Uh, how do I get there again? This way? Yeah, this way. There we go. That was a cool room. Do, 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 do. It's kind of serving as an excuse for you to use this emote. Is it because I have a dry mouth done? Are you trying to say something? <laughs> You found people who will literally stream 10 years regularly. You don't automatically attract people even if you put in effort, yeah. It ain't like Twitch was eight years ago where you just streamed a lot because there were so fewer streamers that you could basically just find a niche of wherever, right? It doesn't work that way anymore. Ha ha, body Rob. Har har har. Pick yourself up by your bootstraps. That's a, that's definite helpful quality. I miss PT. Random raid choice? Yeah, that basically doesn't happen, Don. <laughs> like, I do it to people sometimes. I'll be like, let's look in the retro category. Just find somebody I never heard of. But even then, I don't do that as much as I'd like to. It's uncommon. Yeah, I've never had a raid like that, Delph. Never had a thousand plus person raid ever in seven plus years and even if even when i've seen them happen to other streamers at the end of the day they got maybe a couple regulars out of it which is awesome but people think that like that is a huge game changer it's not it just makes the night for the most part and hopefully you make some new friends you know which you have this almost an equivalent likelihood of making friends from a small raid as you do a big one right of like getting regulars it's it's almost the same what's up cheese in sim i don't know who that is <clears throat> someone who plays okay he almost always raids at random in that category nice Fun to see a guy girl at five viewers get 3,000. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Oh! <laughs> this game. <laughs> all right, all right. I get you. Let's not stand on that too long. You gotta jump. Ugh. <laughs> uh. You get to say secret sauce. Oh, okay. Gotcha. You used to get hosted by Magic's official channel when you did Magic the Gathering quite often. Retaining viewers was rare. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Retention is really hard. That's why whenever I raid, I'm like, yo, folks, let's... My last favor of the night, right? Is to stick with me on a raid. Jeez. All right, I gotta figure out how to kill these without getting my ass reamed like that. What do they expect me to do there? Jump. Like, as soon as you land, you gotta jump. That's it. Phasmo is super entertaining. I've never been into those games. I, I don't know. Like, I guess it, to me, it's like the same as Dead by Daylight. Like, I fall asleep when I watch those streams. That new Demon one looks decent, though, because it, like, gaslights everyone. Which might sound toxic, but think about it. Like, you're in a cooperative horror game, and your teammate sees, like, maybe a ghost or a shadow or whatever. 
but it doesn't actually show up for the other person. Like it's actively gaslighting the players as a means of psychological horror. And I think that's really clever. Oh dear. We're okay. Ah! Oh boy. Fuck! <laughs> this sucks without the spike. Oh man. All right. Where are you going? Hit him in the butt with a yo-yo. Okay. That's how you kill mummies, right? You hit him in the butt with a yo-yo. Nope. Oh, boy. Yeah, that was doomed anyway. <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah, for sure. This game is legit NES hard, so it's got that going. It's pretty wild, yeah. Yeah, I'm not big on those kind of games, but I can respect what Demonologist is doing. It's pretty clever. Yeah, right, Tristan? Yeah. The yo-yo was originally created to be a weapon. Really? Like the actual yo-yo, huh? Who's that? Philadelphia 267 as a gift and a sub the two don't spooky. Was that supposed to be an Italian voice? I don't know. Where's Penny? She's still here. Maybe she can tell us. <laughs> what voice is it on right now? Uh, oh, French. Okay. Let's see. What voice is it on? Let me check. Uh, custom variable inspector. It's on Matthew. Yeah, that's French. M-A-T-H-I-E-U. I'm pretty sure that's the French one. <laughs> that was cool. Uh, thank you, Del, for the gift sub. The Don. Spooky, man. Thank you for your generosity. I did set a sub goal back to 500 to play Monkey Island 2. Also, oh my god. Look at the little man. Oh, he's on his tree, Chad. He's on his tree. Mog's on his tree. Hold on, let me fix the lighting. It's It does this now. There you go. He's on his tree. He's doing the face plant. Hold on. Can we capture the face plant? Hold on, hold on. That's how he sleeps. Just face first. Right into it. What a goof. <laughs> yeah, he literally face plants when he sleeps. He's such a goofy little guy. Oh, man. Isn't it, though, Lucky? I know, right? It's adorable. He's got personality, this little man. <laughs> yeah, that's what he do. You having a good rest there, Moggy? Look at look at he messed up that pole. I think we need to get a new tree. He's starting to shred into the pole. Yeah. He got it good. <clears throat> he got it real good. Yeah, it's 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 about time for a new tree. That one's like 10 years old at least. Yeah, we'll keep that right up there. It's gonna block a little bit of the gameplay, but I'll move the uh capture container here to block less of it there you go so there's only a little corner to take it out now <clears throat> yeah what up Zyfreak works well if it's too bright I should try it I can't breathe if I do that <laughs> he seems to be having no issue though <clears throat> do 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 Nice, the one shot, huh? Okay, so we just gotta kill all these octopi. <laughs> Zach Freak, I just realized I don't know if we've seen Zapara tonight. I don't actually know. Now that I think about it. 
Same. Yeah, same. I can't wait either. It's a lot of fun, you know? Do 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 do. There we go. Okay. We can stay right here. We can chill. <clears throat> it's dead. Dang. All right. Yeah. So I should have messaged you earlier. I didn't realize. Yo, J Mac, how are you? All right. So we got to time this, right? Because we have to land where there's a gap. Oh, that's rude. It looks like after that one right there is probably the best spot. That one, that lone one there. <sighs> okay. Here we go. Go. Rude game is rude. We got it though. We got it. Okay. <gasps> I hold my breath when games are tense. Oh, that's fine, Die Freak. Yeah, don't worry about it, dude. Dude, 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 got your car back yesterday. Oh, a little story, huh? What is that? A shell. Okay, I'm gonna check for secrets because this room is sus. This room is a little sus. <clears throat> this room is suspicious and I don't like it. Boss! Oh, hell. Okay. There we go. Oh, that hurt it. <clears throat> oh, mistakes were made. Oh, man, this thing is ruining my day. <laughs> Fuck this thing. <clears throat> Come on down. We, you, you, you. <clears throat> I lost my stronger weapon because it kept hitting me. Just get wrecked. I don't know what that was, but it's dead. <laughs> Watch this game fuck my shit up at the very end. That would be so mean. Okay. It's still going! Oh, that was a mini boss. <sighs> Fucking my shit up at the end. <laughs> GG. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> Bye, Rob. Good luck, dude. Yeah, I'm part went to leave it on Tuesday. Courtesy car and said I need to put fuel in it. I told you it took unleaded diesel. Oh dear. Oh dear. Unleaded diesel. They told you the wrong fuel, didn't they? Did that? Doesn't that like destroy an engine? <laughs> like, doesn't that basically write it off? <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Do, 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 do. Oh no. Um, huh? How do I? Oh, I see. I see. Secret. Secret. Oh, you're still dim. Okay. I can, I can, I can, I can fuck with this, okay? <clears throat> I, I can do this. Get in the courtesy car, drive across the road to the gas station by accident. You put in unleaded petrol. Oh, jeez, dude. So they didn't mess up. You did. 
Whoops. Whoops. I got baseball. Now what? Um. I, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I go in that one down on the bottom there. Let's check that one. Who puts a light switch on the floor? Yeah. I'm not too pleased with that either. Oh! Okay. There you go. There you go. Brook? <clears throat> Latch? I thought for a minute it would let me grind hearts, but they don't respawn. Dang. <clears throat> Dang. What? What? Uh. Oh dear. These are like worse bats. No! Get away! What is that? What is this item? Hold on. Oh, come on! <laughs> it didn't work. <sighs> Stupid baseball. Super boots. This is the boot room. Uh, okay. What does that mean? <clears throat> Play Dom and ask what fuel it took. Oh, jeez. You don't know what it means. Okay. What's the boot room? <laughs> I'm afraid. I don't know what to do and I'm scared. Dun, 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 dun. Boots. It does that. Wow. You did that and it turns out the car was unleaded petrol the whole time. Oh my goodness. Task failed successfully. <laughs> Jeez. Oh! I don't know what those baseballs do, but apparently nothing. Run! Well, those take hits, huh? Oh, not fair. It was probably fair, honestly. Honestly, it was probably fair. I walked into that and I died! Oh, God! <sighs> okay, I'm fine. We're gonna do this. <clears throat> They're not looking good. Let's take eight million hits to die. <sighs> okay. Let's go. You have to use boot. I don't like boot. Their boot's not bad, you know. I can I can I can get down with boot. I'm gonna check something. What if there's a secret on this side and we're just being neglectful, you know? Oh, well, that was fun. Do 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 do. Also, I added 15 new sound effects yesterday. I don't know if any of you have tried them yet. <laughs> have you? Has anyone used them yet? I don't know. Baseball. Mm, those don't do anything. Do do 24 and 25, yeah. <laughs> Use boot! Okay, boot's actually kind of dope, so let's give boot credit. Hammer! Hammer. <laughs> <laughs> that one's pretty good. <clears throat> I think it's top nut. That, that one doesn't get used weird. a lot. It's not a very popular one. Nice. No! Bad fireballs! Okay. Only eggs can sustain me. Well, you'll have to learn how to eat something else. Only eggs is not healthy. Ah! Oh, man. This is harrowing. Bye, Curly. Thanks for hanging out. Dude, dude. Go in my pants. 
Uh, I don't know what that one is, but, uh, you know, do what you gotta do. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Wait. Did you know? No! Don't take away my spikies! Did you know? That was not one of the ones I added, but that one's great. Is that Daz recorded that himself for us. <laughs> oh shit! This is cool. Oh okay. I'm not gonna lie. I thought the the floor. Okay, this is scary. I thought the floor was gonna start disappearing. I feel like I need to do this here. This. Sometimes this is a thing. I feel like this was just to slow me down. Because I couldn't run from the mummies in this room. You can only jump for some reason on these. That's from a uh, Reiki. Best hero upon. Don't walk on the trap doors. You can't. That's the thing. That's why this was tricky. When you're on a tile like this, you can only jump. I should have used a boot, right? That was the play. I don't know why I didn't do that. I wasn't thinking. I was panicking. Tenacious D? No. I don't allow movies, popular music, or TV because I don't want DMCA takedowns. Do, 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 do. Woo! No DMCA. I don't want to deal with that. That was a nightmare when that got dropped on us with two or three days war warning. Do, 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 do. Whoa, look at that thing. Uh... That didn't do anything. Baseball! Wow. Are you immune? I guess? Okay. Throw a ball in his mouth. What the fuck is this boss? <laughs> Fine! <laughs> is this Gradius? Yeah, it is now. <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna have to figure out how to kill that thing. Oh. Holy heck. <laughs>